Hello. I think it's time for some. Let's see if this works. Uh, and up, up, up. don't worry, I have this worked out. Ah, hello, cat minion. Yes, and welcome to my first time streaming this randomizer. Have I played this randomizer before? Yes, uh, but not this year. This year is the uh, first thing ever. Uh, yeah, I haven't streamed this before. Yes, Chimney. It is a randomizer. Although, it is not Ocarina of Time slash Mirror's Mask. That one is coming. I wanted to warm up with this one. Okay. I hit the button on my controller that did some weird stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. So, Legend of Zelda. Yes. When I was a kid, we absolutely had this game. I really don't remember how, though. Yeah, I was that young, and uh, it was basically me watching my big brother to begin with. But I have my own memories from this game, and yes, I loved it. And I think I think randomizer makes it interesting because it, it makes dungeons more interesting uh, to the point that they feel even more unique than they did in the original version. <laughs> So uh, yeah, we're gonna go for this. I have to, I have to uh, share though a little funny uh, Mandela effect memory. Is that what it's called? Like a fake memory. So I could have sworn that getting the uh, getting the first ring made Link white, like we are white. I that, that was such a memory I was sure of as, as a child. And it also makes sense because you're getting the blue ring, you know, and this was bef a time before I I could read English. And I, I think I think it's great that even though you, you, you didn't understand the game, you could still play and enjoy it. I was having a good time with it. Like uncovering every secret, guessing what everything was. Ooh, this, this nice uh, blue bottle and red bottle, <laughs> you know, they are potion. But, uh, you know, when you can't read and you can't understand, you, you have no idea what they, what they do. Unless you try them out when you're low in health. Like, ah, they heal you. Kind of like that. So, yeah, that was my weird memory that I, I, I was so sure that you became white. <laughs> Even though the ring is called blue ring and you absolutely become blue. So it probably was my TV uh, giving Link such a bleak... Uh, a thin blue color that it was almost like white. Who knows? Anyway, we're gonna jump this out. Register your name. And yes, I have randomized that we are... We are one of these things. What do I call it again? Goira? Hello, what was it? Was it Goraya? Is it Goraya or Goira? I don't remember. Register your name. You know, when I'm creating characters for... RPG and RPG like games. I can take forever making a name. Uh, so yeah, so this is not Link. This is someone else with the with uh, his own adventure. Uh, how about Bunk? <laughs> the, b by the way, the only YouTuber that I watch doing randomizer of this game is uh, is. Um, Pro Jared. Yeah, I've enjoyed his, his uh, videos. And I know he named himself Lank. We can't steal that. So maybe Bunk. Bunk it is. <laughs> Reason. Bunk. Alright. Adventure of Bunk. Commence. So yes, I have scrambled dungeons. I I'm using different pattern for dungeons, scrambling mobs a little bit. Uh, I mixed in second world mobs, but I haven't mixed world mobs with dungeon mobs. So we won't find dungeon mobs on the surface. Yes, Legend of Bunk. Who is lost in the forest? Uh, how's the volume, by the way? Oh, that that, that is. That's too scary for Bunk. He's gonna go this way instead. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Man, I, I, I wish there was a Skull Kid uh, sprite. Then we would absolutely be like the, the Skull Kid lost in the forest. <laughs> Bunk needs to find weapon. <laughs> Go, Bunk. <laughs> Bunk's first game. Bunk is finding. Uh. Uh. What are those called again? Peacock. Pea hat. This is creepy. Bunker's gonna leave you now. <laughs> That's actually kind of creepy. <laughs> Alright, we're out in the desert. Uh, not too many caves I can explore there. Oh! Run, Bunk! Oh, ooh, dodge that. Oh, not that very pleasant. <laughs> <laughs> Poor bank, everyone is off the <laughs> uh, So, we, we're gonna see if... Uh, yes, for even the wooden sword is mixed in. It doesn't have to be a cave, even. It can be... Uh... By the way, is this mirrored? Yeah, I think I forgot to mention that. I have... I've used mirror. Ah! Uh... Please let let bank pass. So it's uh, it's yeah it's the whole world is flip flopped, and trust me that is enough for me to be confused and it feels like a whole new world for me. If it's mirrored, I'm pretty sure. I hope there was. We need some kind of. I need proof. So uh, the only thing I'm going after here. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this used to be to the right and now it's to the left. The only thing I'm going after here is that I have not 100% looked up every secret, okay? So I'm going after my own memories and... Uh, so I know there is a secret here, but that's not because I looked up in the internet, it's because... You know, I discovered it as a kid or a friend of mine told me later on. I, I'm going after my own knowledge when it comes to this game. Uh, that means that I'm not sure this is... Okay, oh! <laughs> Oh, bank! Huh. Oh. Oh. Aquamentus awaits with the Triforce. A bank is too poor to be in here. <laughs> okay, so now the likes like they... Not only... Wait, does that mean that... The dungeon enemies are... No, 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 they can't be... Old people running around as enemies. No, 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 no. That, has, that, that is a friendly like, like. And this one here as well. <laughs> Bunk is scared. <laughs> ah! Come on, Bunk, you can do it. Oh. Oh. No. Oh. Ah! Oh. Okay, so. I'm, <laughs> I'm doing the 360 controller D-pad. It is a very... I gotta say... Bunk. It is a very... Hmm. It is nice and big, but it's very sloppy. I think it's a nice word for it. It's very uh, unprecise. Oh! Oh! No. I like the clothes. <laughs> like... <laughs> Bunk is wearing a mask. <laughs> he's, he's, too, he's too shy to show his real face to people. <laughs> So he's wandering around these forests looking for adventure on his own. I should get back to that point because I really want to know what's beneath that statue. Like for this for this example, I, I, I'm not 100% sure. Here I know there's one I can use candle on and here's another one. But sometimes I mix in second quest with first quest. This is first quest by the way. Oh, this is scary. And I think there's one here as well. Oh, I need to go. I want to get to the uh, original beginning. There's lots of caves over there. <laughs> okay, so this one. Mm, not the best. Oh yeah, I, I went the... Okay, so I, I went the uh, correct way. But it felt like the wrong way. Oh, I seen on TV. 
Okay, so the advices I have used mixed, so it's community slash helpful. Okay, expensive keys, that is not good because we're gonna need a lot of keys. I, I, I did try another seed earlier uh, this week. And uh, uh, for example, I, I found the first dungeon and I, in the very next room I needed a key. Like I needed, and that was a nice experience. Like I needed to actually buy a key. Which way to the One Direction concert? Okay. Uh, I want to find a fairy. Ah! So, if you see me doing something really stupid, like walking into an enemy, uh, there is a fairy. Do I even have a shield, by the way? It doesn't look like it on the sprite, but I'm gonna assume that I have a shield because Link begins with a shield. Or am I at a disadvantage by using this sprite? <laughs> Poor bunk. All the other heroes, they were giving a shield as a starter. But bunk? No. Sorry, I need to. Yeah, yeah, okay. So now I know. Wait, 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 wait. We need to cross the bridge. There is a cave. So all the way. <laughs> so if you see me make a stupid mistake or miss or something, it's not because, oh yeah, old game with bad controls. I actually like the controls in the level set. It's just this D-pad is just the worst for this. <gasps> Okay, so we can assume that we have a small shield, all right. Uh, there's a cave. Ah, oh, this is not the... Bunk is scared. <laughs> Bunk, go for it, Bunk. No. No, no, oh! Ah! Oh, oh, no, no. <laughs> this is not easy. <laughs> oh. So how do I get money? Because I presume that, I mean, I need to buy. Oh yeah, so yeah, I need to find secret. I need to be lucky. I need to find enough money from. <laughs> oh, we spend on a controller. I mean, yes, I don't want to be that kind of person. Believe me, in this one instance, this controller's D-pad is not trustworthy. Uh, I could use the GameCube, but that one is so small and I have big hands, so it just hurts using it. Ah. I, I really need to use to cross the bridge. Okay, we're enough. Oh, come on. <laughs> okay, go bank. Now is the chance. Uh, totally worth it. Oh, more spiders. I need to check this one. Oh. Come on. You really shouldn't have touched that. Touch what? <laughs> Bunk is so sorry. <laughs> Everyone's so mean to Bunk. What's happening? I mean, that's the very nature of a monster, I guess. Oh! Okay. 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 No! <laughs> the, this is not the best enemy to... To meet when you're not having a weapon. Uh, I could take a take a giant detour just to skip that, I guess. Would it surprise me if there is blue spiders? Ah, uh, oh, see, I need to make such a pre such precise bullet dodging, and I can't believe I'm putting it off with this controller. Okay, so we're gonna actually, yeah, we're gonna use this path. If this even is a path. So, yes. Uh, wait, 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 I think this is not enough. This is just gonna, yeah, yeah, this is one that's gonna bring me right before the bridge. Right? So, yeah, that is me basically playing games. Uh, I, ooh. I 
think I remember something and then I remember it the wrong way and that's uh, where the excitement comes. Oh my goodness, I got so lucky. <sighs> Ooh! Hello? I, I can get... So, if I go in here and it, it is a locked door. No wait, it can't be a locked door because it, it would have opened. I'm just saying that it is actually possible to get stuck. Oh, it's a green dungeon. Not worth it. See, uh, see, 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 see. That so if I go here, there's a chance that I can get locked in, and I need to uh, destroy enemies to get out again. Uh, this is too scary for bum, bunk, bunk, bunk is leaving. Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, going for it! Oh. But I'm pretty sure that it's impossible for me to... Oh my goodness. What did I tell you? There was going to be spiders on the path. I, I, I can't get around that. I need to use the bridge. <laughs> I need to use the bridge. Uh, we have waterfall. We have two caves over there, don't we? So it is, it is pretty confusing that it's mirrored. Uh, oh, this, this is a scary path. Bug is going Ah! Okay, this is good. There's the waterfall. <laughs> Ooh, advanced to go collect 200 rupees. Oh, Bug is so happy. 54. That is not a bad amount. So. Now here's the scary part. I want to continue explore caves because now I have enough money. I can also lose money if it's a door repair guy. And I, I'm not sure if it's no. Oh, okay, thank you. I can go back. So we actually had three caves to explore. Here. Okay, that is not randomized. You're supposed to be there. You really shouldn't have touched that. Oh, so they, okay, they are, no, they are the door. Okay, back to square one, we Ah, uh, if I had a money, oh, if I had a money, I think we'll afford, afford a candle. Oh, uh, if, if we find a candle now, on top of this mountain, I'm gonna be sour. <laughs> Go, bunk. Oh, that was... Oh no, it's a... Oh no, oh! Okay, cheap shield and an, a little bit cheaper key. Why can't Zelda crawl? That, that, that sounds like a typical monster question. Why can't Zelda crawl like us? <laughs> Although you're not crawling, you're flying. So, one thing that I never understood... Okay, I came back. Uh, at every original dungeon location, you can actually open up a additional staircase entrance that is just a staircase to the same dungeon. Why? Like, why did they... Oh, I'm going to perish. Why did they even... put it in the game? It is really weird. It's like, yeah, here's an additional route to the dungeon. And there's no difference in taking that path from taking the original big entrance. Okay, I need to read the map. Oh! I need to cross that bridge. <laughs> I really need to do that. I need to, I need to compose a song now, Legend of Bunk. <laughs> I need to do that. <laughs> it's gonna be like a sadder version of this theme. Oh no, 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 I forgot that. I wonder why that arrow is pointing to the left. Like, they really wanted to go to the left there. Oof. Ooh, hoo, hoo. No, no. Hello, tree. Okay. 
92. Okay, just go for it. Just go. Oh, like, it's, it's insane that they, it seems like they're randomly hopping, hopping around. Did I check this one? And as soon as you try to get past that. Ooh. Yes, thank you. But I'm so happy. I, I'm lucky with the randomized numbers. So all we need to do now is just to find... Oh, come on. As soon as you get close to them, they seem, it seems like they're like homing into you. Uh, oh, here's the fairy. Oh, please. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, I'm bored. <laughs> I don't know, but Bank with these clothes, it seems like he's just a little forest minion. And is trying to do his own little adventure and it, nothing goes his way. <laughs> that is the story, that is the <laughs> destiny of Bank. Okay. Need a flute. Uh, I need to activate my brain. So, original dungeon 2 is this. No, it's not this way. Uh, okay, I'm not lost. Uh... Oh, wait, 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 yeah. That's right, it's mirrored. It should be here. Yes. Oh, it's heavily guarded. <clears throat> oh. oh! I'm gonna guess those are medicine spots. What can I check now? I guess I need, I need to. I need. I can't get bombs unless I can defeat enemies. I guess we can check the graveyard. Here, I know there's another one here. So let's see here. I do, I do like that this one reappears in the Oracle of Seasons, but uh, you're doing it in different seasons instead. That was very confusing for me back in the days. I struggled with that one. Because uh, it's basically the same directions, but each step should be in a warmer season than the one before. That one was really, really difficult for me to understand at younger days, at uh, teenager ages. Uh, it should be... no. It should be up here, rather than this one. Uh, Mark is scared. Oh no! <laughs> Bug just, just wanted to find a new friend beneath grave. <laughs> you find all sorts of friends beneath graves. <laughs> that makes Bunks creepy. I don't want them. Bunk is... Cute and innocent. And he's brave. I wouldn't dare to go down that big gap of entrance. Uh oh. Oh, golden. Oh! Some first bunk is lucky! Oh! <laughs> Whoops. Oh. Poor bunk. It's not going well. <laughs> Uh, what what do we have more? Where can I check? I can check the coast. There's one cave there. Let's just go left. So th there is a tiny chance that I, there is secrets that I I know. Here's here's the staircase. I know. Bank knows. There is a small chance that I. I am not aware of a specific secret. I know here's one, don't worry. Because I am going off my own knowledge. <clears throat> Actually, did I want it to go up there? No, I don't think so. Maybe here. Oh, wait, wait, down there is a statue. We didn't check that one. No, 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 no! I'm just gonna take this. Oh, well, that was unnecessary because it went the other direction. Okay. 
give Bunk something nice. <laughs> oh no. Oh yes! <laughs> I thought it was a door one. You're a nice monster. Ah, oh, we we can absolutely afford a candle if we find one. Uh, oh, Dungeon 2! Original Dungeon 2 was not here, so it's, it's to the right instead. Right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, wait, wait, can I get locked there? I can't. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> Poor bank. <laughs> Or is it Backstorf Bunk? Yes! <laughs> Whoa, did you hear what Putz just said? Who's Putz? No. Yeah! The Backstorf of Bunk is that he wanted to be he wanted to live in the Kukiri, with the Kukiri in the... Oh, it's just called Kukiri Forest, right? There's no name for that specific village. And they rejected him. And so now he has to run around. I know it's not the same location. And oh! Oh! <laughs> that is a horrible, terrible <laughs> fate for Bunk. Oh, I need to go back there. Okay, I need to be more cautious, but now we have more health. Trapped. <laughs> dead end. There is there is a spot here called the dead end. We should go there. Yeah, top left is our best. Uh, northwest is our best. Uh, there is lots of caves to explore there. to the left. I, I, I swear, all, all because it's it's mirror flipped. It, it just feels... <laughs> I Maybe I should check. I think I mixed the... Uh, it's not just a hard curtain over here. It could be something else now. Wait, it's not here. Yeah, it's not here. This is just a raft spot. What's down here, by the way? <gasps> oh, never mind. Bunk. Bunk gets the message. He gets the message. Bunk leaves. <laughs> So Bunk is now an exile. Even the monsters don't want to deal with him. Is there? I I don't remember. Is this cave open? Yes, oh, of course. <gasps> Bunk's worst nightmare. Oh. Okay, maybe. No. So I I I I do remember. And here's the thing, in my memory, I need six hearts to grab the uh, level two sword, the white sword. But maybe it's just five? I'm not really sure about this one. Here's the dead end. Oh, spiders! <clears throat> this is Punk's home now. Okay, it's not. Oh no. <laughs> the door is not broken. It was all open. It's oh, it's super expensive. <laughs> can can I can I actually get locked now? What what if I find is what if there's more trap doors than than money secrets? Someone took Oris home while he was away. Oh yes, poor bank. There's a random monster like get out of here. It's my house now. A poor bunk. This is this is poor. This is Bunk's adventure to find a new home. And he needs a candle because he's living outside. <laughs> he need, he wants just a nice cozy light at at night. Eighty rupees. Am I gonna go with Swedish? I gonna say kronor. There's the Swedish money. 
80 kronor. Ja, men sen 80. <laughs> It's gonna be difficult. Oh. Wait, 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 where can bank go now? I think this is a bad choice. E no, okay. This is the money making game. Okay, chat, I need you. Bank needs your help. Which one is the correct one? We're gonna have a vote. Which one? We we need this. We need this badly. <laughs> but but can kind of decide. This is actually me. I am having a really hard time uh, taking decisions. At at least when it's it's even worse if I'm if I have in company. If I go for a pizza place with some friends, uh, oh, yeah. And all of my friends would decide pizza just like that. And, and I can stand like, oh my goodness, I don't know what should what should I take middle one. I mean, yeah. <laughs> Minor minus equals plus, so we went up two. Can I go? Can I actually go back here? Okay. Okay, go for another quest, uh, another guess. I mean. Oh, ooh, that was that was by mistake. I can show you that. Left. Yes, nice chat. You are amazing. You read that monster like an open. Okay, I I actually cannot die now. I need to grab. Okay, okay, no panic, no panic. Just read the Lionels. He's gonna turn and okay, shooting the wrong way. Yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Bank's future is looking bright now. <laughs> oh, that is such a relief. That is a oh, okay. I, I did not watch for that sword. Uh, ah, that felt good. <laughs> Bank's adventure, more like Bank's revenge. <laughs> Can I... Will they respawn? Four spiders, if I go back and forth... Yeah, okay. They won't respawn. Oh, I can't. I can't. Oh, that is such a lucky... Oh, I'm so happy we went for this. Yes! <gasps> Our first money. <laughs> yes. <laughs> It's kind of horrifying when you think about that. <laughs> Just now I'm bunkering around, putting enemies on fire. <laughs> oh, it's, uh... And he's a monster himself, so. Oh! <laughs> but they stole his home. <laughs> but, but, but the thing is that I, I guess so many parents today will feel will find it horrifying today, and it would be more horrifying. Imagine if it was made with today's graphics. It 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 would it wouldn't fly. <laughs> it will not really fly. <laughs> but back then, you know, uh, you know, because there was there was still imagination. So even though the graphics looked like this, in your mind you were absolutely having, you know, oh man, how it would look like. And uh, is it this one? And so you, you you didn't make the connection that you're actually put the enemies of fire and how horrifying it is. You you was you was looking at it like a yeah I'm on an adventure using a magic item to make this enemy perish. That's it. There's nothing more to it. The bunker. Uh, whoa, whoa, where did you come from? Oh, take over. Uh, no, this is just oh, I can't even afford it. But this is advice, and I don't need advice. Mean monsters put tree above Bunk's home. So I guess whatever is in here, this is our start screen. I mean, if there even is a secret entrance here. If there is, then this is Bunk's home. But I don't think there is. No. Bunk is very... Oh! <gasps> Bunk's home! I can go back. Oh, wow! Bombs! Amazing! And Petty Sheep too. And the blue ring. Alright, this is nice. 
and I don't even have to memorize that because it's in store screen. So, I... <gasps> wait, 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 wait. Right? Isn't there a one here? Uh, okay. Oh, <laughs> I clicked on my controller. Stab. <laughs> I can't. <sighs> <laughs> he he looks like a poor little like he is like a mini for mini version of a uh, of a moblin, and then mo other mobs is bullying him. <laughs> Get the ugly one. It's like a little like the ugly duckling story, but it's it's with bunk instead. Uh, there is one here as well, uh, not here, I'm pretty sure. Oh, yeah. <laughs> See? Can't even trust my own knowledge. Whoa! This... This is Bunk's calling. This is the legend calling for him. He is born for this. To throw... What? No! This is Bunk's special... Special move! What? What? Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh. Okay. I guess Bunk, Bunk doesn't really memorize to do the one thing he should be the best at. Throwing boomerangs. So the boomerangs are heart locked and the sword isn't? Is that how it goes? That sounds really weird and I... Uh, oh. Okay, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. It's this place. Uh, here's a lots of caves instead. Ah! Uh. No, that was really close. Oh, fairy. The only friend Bunk has. Because even the, the quote-unquote friendly monsters in the case so far have been saying weird, mean things to him, so... No one is on Bunk's side. <gasps> oh no. Oh, okay. Bunk, he, he just punched that arrow. <laughs> it's like, get away! <laughs> <That's>... <laughs> uh, I don't think there is a burn spot here, but I'm pretty sure there's a burn spot here. But lots of enemies. Gonna check this one. Maybe here. Yes. Yes. Nice, we have bombs. But we can pry and look for more forest spots. Tree spots. So I'm I'm really curious how the dungeons will look like. When I tried this early this week, I didn't use the the new pattern. I used the original patterns, but I, but I mixed the dungeon rooms. So we're gonna see how this one works out. Money making game. No, we're not gonna take the risk because I really want the f four bombs. Will be amazing right now. Oh, here we go. I'm so lucky. I'm so incredibly lucky. Okay, so here's how it works. I I really not sure which one is. I, so my memory is like half memories. I kind of know where the spots are. And I really, I know there's one here, but I, was it here? No! Okay. Mm. No, what? There is one here. Are you... <sighs> okay. <laughs> yes, you're gonna be used to this. Alright. At least we got more money. Bank is... Rich. <laughs> is there any other vital item? Like the meat feels like a bonus? And that's the thing. I don't... I, 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 all I know is that you're supposed to give the meat to the Grumble Grumble uh, one. But I don't remember where it was. <laughs> 
This should be the easiest cave to remember as well. It's, it's straightforward, but I, I'm, I'm telling you, all because it's mirrored, I'm getting, I'm getting so, <laughs> I'm so uncertain of things now. I can't trust myself. No. <laughs> oh. I need to get to the start screen. Ah! <laughs> There is more burn spots. I need to find the rest of them. Ah, oh, spiders. Perish. Oh, nice. Or, I mean, there's something at least. Oh, there's one here. I know this. Yes. Please don't take my money. No. <laughs> a bug tries to run away, but <laughs> greedy spiders takes it all. Uh, oh, wait, no, 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 no. Here, two spots. Here's two spots. So, I guess that's a kind of a blessing for me. Is that I... No, not gonna, not gonna take the risk. Is that I... A few memories. I, I, I When I play a game, depending on how long, long time it takes, I, I forget stuff. And so, <laughs> every time I play a game that I love, at some parts, it's gonna feel like I'm doing it for the first time. I'm not even joking. Like, I, I kind of know what's happening, but I don't remember exactly what's happening. This is why I will never be able to speedrun. Trust me. <laughs> <I'm, laughs> it just will never work out. So I'm, I'm more of an in-the-moment reacting kind of fellow. And my memory tells me it's straight in the middle, but it, it's not. That should be middle. No bunk runs around trying to burn down every plant he sees. <laughs> we, we need a... Oh, there we go. So it's not... See? It was not in the middle. We need a... Uh, okay, character development. Why is bunk burning down the forest? Ten. Bunk will remember you. <laughs> when Bunk finds his sword. <laughs> no, I don't want a Bunk to be that kind of <laughs> being. Can I go up here? I mean, I can, but... Yeah, it's this spot again. Oh! Is there a... I don't... I do not think that there's a burn spot down there. Oh, uh, here's the thing. I know that there's a bomb spot in the desert, but I, I really don't know which one, and it's just gonna cost so many bombs. I don't want to do it now, right now. <sighs> Away with you. Uh, up there, I think we have done everything we can up there, right now. Oh no, don't have sword. Oh, okay, I need to be really lucky with uh with next bomb. You can go this way. <laughs> go bang, go! <laughs> Ooh, that was close. I also think that I've changed the... Um... Ooh... <laughs> Uh, the item group for mobs. So, for example, in the original game, you know that, yeah, blue Octrox, they will usually drop uh, bombs. It's not the case now. It's absolutely different. Please, no enemies. <laughs> Here? Question mark? Oh! This one. So, game design wise, I love that in a riddle game. Oh, nice! In a riddle game, this is Dungeon 7, I think? Or is it 8? Oh, I don't remember. Okay, nice. So, that bomb spot was just a. Wait, is this one saved now? 
All right, good to know. I should explore the other ones. Oh yeah, okay, so wasn't really that much of a jump. <laughs> hey, wait, wait, wait! That's perfect! Nice! One of the transport spots leads right to my home. And my fellow like-like. <laughs> oh, we can buy more bumps. No, I, I I want animated version of like of a light like dude. Bombs, ropes, <laughs> it's yours, my friend. <laughs> In return, I, I he's my pet light like. In return, bunk feeds him shields he finds in the forest. <laughs> now we 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 we're beating up a little uh, lore here. <laughs> Maybe uh, one part of Link's adventure is that. He a bunk tried to steal his uh, wooden shield, his deco shield, <laughs> because he wanted to feed his friend. Oh no! I mean, yes, but at the same time, oh no! Quick! Oh! <laughs> I I real I really hope it wasn't. But here, come on! Of what? What? There's no. Sp mm. Bunk. Oh. oh, I can't. There's no fire spot. There. Why? I lie in else. I. Oh yes. I can't even afford the hearts, and I, I want the keys. We need the keys. Uh, okay, that's the one is still a heart container. Weird. I'm pretty sure I picked that. I should randomize that. Run, bank. Oh, no. You're surrounded. <laughs> Zelda see the eye when? Never. Simple as that. <laughs> I should refuse to play that. <laughs> oh, here's a new one. Oh, come on, bank. This is your... This is your... Time to shine. And you know what? <laughs> you know what just struck me? I do not remember where that boomerang was. <laughs> I should write things down. Okay. I have a piece of paper. Because I'm a retro gamer. And we need a pencil. That should be here. I actually cleaned my bedroom, so... It should be here. Thankfully, I have a big... Little jar of pens, pencils here, Ugh. and also I, it's an old one that I paint. I painted like uh, the little Zelda. I'm gonna show it to you. It's really messy right now, but I can take a picture of it. I sent it on Discord. <laughs> it's a fine piece of art. Oh, I think it was close to home. That is, that is true. <clears throat> no. Yes, make bank rich. <laughs> ah, bank will remember this one. Bunk. I, I don't want to say bank. It's it's bunk. Uh, it's the Swedish. <laughs> I'm so, I'm, so, I, I'm so scared. Uh, is this this one? Oh, it is. Mm. Okay. So. Since I'm really bad at making maps. Okay. How should I make this system? How many how many squares? Uh, what does it look like? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Is it ten? Ten times something? The the world map, like the size of the world map. Is it just 10? No, is it? No, it's just... Wait. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, No, it's just 8, isn't it? How many squares is it from, from north to south? Because I want to draw a grid system here. The 
this is actually a, like I miss this part of gaming, where you actually had a piece of paper or something. I had a notebook that I wrote down secrets for games, and even even uh, when I played the Lord of the Rings games and a very rare item dropped, I I noted in my book what kind of stats it had because it was so nice stats, but I couldn't save it because I I'm a hoarder when it comes to. <laughs> Rare items in looting games. I absolutely love rare, rare things. Way too lazy to write things down. And you know, it, that is actually, you know, when uh, it is, you, you can absolutely, you, you're right. Because now I used to write a lot, you know, by pencil text, you know, going to school and stuff like that. Uh, we still use lots of pen and paper back then. But all that is gone now, and you know, it's been more like a several years. A, a few years ago, I started writing my own story, and my hand was crappy. It was <laughs> it was really difficult to write by hand because those muscles have they are long gone. <laughs> okay, until I know the grid size, I can note that. Uh, Outside Dungeon 2, D-O as in original Dungeon 2, there is, uh, there is what? Okay, so, key, shield, and meat. So yeah, so I, I miss that, uh, you know, you, you wrote your own, you draw, you were drawing your own maps and and uh, taking notes. Uh, Cat Minion, I'm really fond of games like The Witness, Fess or Tunic that, oh, uh, I need to take, go to safe spot first before I re read the chat. <laughs> Bunkers, I don't think there's a spot there. Uh -uh. So yes, poor, poor Bunk is a very, he can easily get lost. Okay, back to the coast. Can we survive the coast? I don't think we can. Oh no, I got stuck. If I didn't get stuck at the rock. Uh, Fond of games like Witness Fest or Tunic that try to capture that feeling. Needed multiple sheets of paper of notes to figure stuff out. Yes, and <laughs> weird enough, if they implemented such tools in the game, it wouldn't be the same thing. It's weird, but... That's true. Wait, wait what? I'm... Really? Those are not burn spots? We have more bombs, by the way. I really hope I haven't walked past a bomb spot because I'm busy talking. So this one I need a short. Okay, here I, this is an easy one. I'm not going for the ones in the desert. Absolutely not. Like I know there's a bomb spot here, but I don't remember exactly where. It's impossible for me to know. Here though, here we have one. Okay. Bunk, be very careful with those now. Okay, but was it left side or right side? Of the, I think it's left side now. It used to be right, but now it's left side. I should be right. Yes. Oh no. Bunk is so sorry. <laughs> he just tries to have his own adventure. Oh, thank you for that block. Oh, it's, it's like they know. They know that. See, they're bullying him, Bunk. Oh, are you kidding me? Oh. <laughs> you should be on Bunk's side. Ah, <sighs> oh, 
Okay. Oh, wait, we have four more bombs. I thought it was the last bomb. We're good, we're good. No! We could touch the statues. We... Mm. Come on. We could touch the statues. Here they are. And... Okay, this is gonna be scary. Oh! <gasps> <laughs> is that good for us? I don't think that's good for us. I think that's absolutely worthless for us because I have enabled. I have, it's not explosive, okay? I've, I know that's, an, that's a custom option in. I don't even remember what that's doing for me. <laughs> it's a piece of book. It's a book. A piece of book. It's a book. The bunk is going to cherish this book. It is only... <laughs> it's it's just me and the book now. <laughs> that, that, that is Bunk's companion. There's no fairy like Navi. It's his book. No. That he can't even read. <laughs> uh... Uh... Uh, maybe they weren't trying to bully you, but tried to stop you from losing your money. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Bunk, don't go down there, they're gonna scam you. <laughs> so... <laughs> Bunk, he, he he trusts ev anyone. That, that's his problem. He He's so naive. Oh! Oh! I mean, for, for people trying to stop Bunk from getting scammed, they are taking some serious <laughs> actions. <laughs> Shooting arrows at him. Bunk, don't! <laughs> I, th I don't think the story holds up. I think we checked this. Yes, we did. But I'm gonna shake it again. Yeah. Uh, I, I think I think there's a scammer up there. Actually, they, they are they are very much a scammer because they... Sometimes... They, I mean, the door is open. They still... <laughs> take money for it. I haven't tried all the teleports. Let's go for this one. Why are Paul's voice Im Im immune to bombs? That's uh, interesting. Question. Oh, ooh, this was a good one. Ooh, shortcut to this area. Now here we need lots of bombs. Okay, and, and I need to be 100% sure that is a... I'm not 100% sure. Is that a bomb spot? <laughs> I am not 100% sure that I'm 100% sure that this is, that, that is a bomb spot. <laughs> that this is my issue. <laughs> no! Oh! <laughs> it's like... <laughs> I feel so sorry for Bunk. <laughs> it's like a chubby little youngling Goira is tr trying to find his way through this world. <laughs> and everyone is so mean to him. He just he needs he wants his boomerang. You know what? I I, I don't wanna accidentally press the button. That was a good one. <gasps> Thank you. It's, it's, I think it's amazing that in this game, the, the entrance to the last dungeon, to the last boss, the arch fiend of this world, it's just a random rock. Oh! Okay, level 9 is not randomized. But it should be. I've, yeah. I'm pretty sure I'm using the same settings. Oh, Bunk is... Oh, he's like a ghost in here. He's camouflaged. Look. <laughs> no one can see Bunk, no? Okay, but yeah. Lock, lock door. Get on your sheepskate. Okay. That is so weird. Uh, so I think it's... it. <laughs> level 9 got randomized. Yes! 
legacy begins now. Maybe I need the I maybe I just need the sword to get the boomerang. Is that is that is that a possible requirement? That the boomerang is locked behind the sword? Yes. Bunk is no longer afraid of you. <laughs> this is payback. <laughs> Uh, is that a bomb spot? Is that a bomb spot? Uh, but the, the enemies are too dif difficult, sorry. I think he has a bomb spot. Get away from Bunk. Oh yes, we have a shield by the way. I, I keep forgetting it because I can't see it. <laughs> Maybe these were all used to be friends of Bank before they went crazy. <laughs> that, that is also that is a possibility. Oh, oh, oh. <gasps> yes, I should try to get the boom right now. Okay, for those who are apparently a better Zelda fan than I am, <laughs> do you require five or six hearts for White Sword in the original game? I really don't remember. Uh, this is not a bomb spot, but if my memory serves me right, there is one up here. My memory has never served me right. I, I don't even know what I said. Oh, Lionel's. <gasps> oh. uh, I can't. Yeah, technically, I can't defeat them, but. Oh, yes. Is rich once more. By the way, they they stopped using Goyeras as an enemy in the Legend of Zelda series, right? They appeared in Zelda 2, right? And Zelda 2, I had never played a game. It a uh, back then it just went beneath our radar. We had we had uh, Zelda 1, but no, we never picked up uh, the second one. Is there a cave here? I'm so unsure. Oh, oh, oh! There's a, there's one right over here. Oh, oh, thank you. Oh, wow. Oh, nice, pink, nice and pink. <laughs> so like a crystal cake caver. What, what mineral is pinkish? Oh, <laughs> what is the world record for this season? <laughs> oh, I I really didn't want to lose a container. Okay, thank you. That is a very easy Triforce. Oh, oh, we need this. Oh, we need this so hard. I can just, I can just teleport myself out though. I get some health. Oh, we do need the money now, and it is still fifty kroner for me before. Please don't lock me in here. What did it? Please don't lock me in here. Oh wait, okay. I, I, I was, I was very lucky on that one. They can't hurt me, right? Wait, are these the red ones? Is my sword permanently locked now until I meet, until I find a blue one? Yes, it is. Okay, Bunk is extremely unlucky. <laughs> but he, at least he can take shiny stone because it's shiny. <laughs> he has no idea about the legend of the Triforce. No? It's just his. He's like me. He he likes he likes gathering rare shiny stones. <laughs> that is that is his quest. <laughs> and then he would be super confused of why this big uh, moblin wizard is angry at him and wants and wants to steal your shiny stones. <laughs> oh, I know that there's one here. 
Or do I know? Am I just pretending that I know? I have one bomb to my name. Bunk slash bomb. Is there one here? Oh, wait, wait, there is one here. I am so sure of this. Yes. Expensive. Way too expensive. Oh, yeah! Oh, ooh, I forgot this. Yes, we can shoot people. I mean, monsters, moblins. I always get confused here as if, is there a bomb spot here or... Maybe we're so lucky that these actually drop bombs. And I also know the secret. Is it, is it how many enemies do I need to kill without taking damage for a bomb drop? Is it 10th or 10 or 12? I, that's actually a real hint in the game as well. Now, old man tells you that. Like, tenth, the, the, the tenth enemy has the bombs. Or something like that. Yes! What is down here? Potential bomb spots. That's that's what's down here. <gasps> Lucky me. Mm. Maybe there's one here. Oh. See? Alright. Oh, sheep arrows. I mean, so I, I, I do have some memories of the right location, but, but the mirror aspect just messes me up big time. Okay, we check the graveyard. I think I'm gonna try with the boomerang. <gasps> Boonk is going home. Wow, okay, so this one here as well. Wait, where am I? Oh, oh, oh I'm down here! <laughs> mm, bomb spot? Maybe? Wait, I'm gonna sh Una Bomba. No! Maybe here? Oh, see, I'm not so sure, and the thing is, it can absolutely be here or here, but then I will be totally bombless. Mm. Oh, yes! Ooh! Now we absolutely can grab the boomerang. It really makes me happy. No. No, I didn't realize that. Bone cast go all the way. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Aha. Okay. This time I'm gonna guess. I, I promise you, I'm gonna get minus. I think it's the middle one again. Yes. See, I, I should not do this. I need chat, okay? <laughs> I need you. <laughs> oh, oh, this one bomb. This one here, here. As soon as I try something myself, it, it just gets screwed over majorly. <gasps> Some blue rupee. I wonder... That's an interesting design choice. So the one rupee is the one that's flashing. And the blue rupee is the one that does not flash. That is interesting. I wonder why they made that choice. Oh. Bunk is becoming a beefy boy. <laughs> we 
but he's also a poor boy. If I will ever get fan art, I, I want someone to draw him Bunk as a sad little Goira. Or a very insecure. I think I think that's the definition of Bunk. It's very insecure about things. Okay, here they've maybe gotta be a burn spot. <laughs> Bug does it know because he doesn't trust himself. <laughs> No, don't hit me. No! Yeah, hit me. Ooh, that was close. <laughs> Everything is coming up bunk selling. Oh. Because he's now smitten. He wants to find the rest of the shiny stones. No? Just a simple little reason for adventure. Bunk heard about the shiny stones and now he wants to find them. <laughs> it works out. Oh, wow, okay, I wasn't really prepared for that. A new cave. A dungeon! Okay, I think we can actually do this. Uh, we're probably gonna meet a... I'm gonna try something now, okay? So I'm gonna lower the volume. Please tell me if this is too loud, by the way. Uh, let's see here. Is this, is this working? Can you hear the song? I gotta see if how well this fits. Uh, oh my goodness, no, I'm locked in here. Sorry, I, <laughs> I'm still tapped down. How did I not take damn damage? Okay, so yes, it works like, or yes, it's too loud. <laughs> I didn't. Oh, the shoot! Oh! Oh, Bunk finds nice shiny stone. So, yes, this, this is a song I composed. Uh, uh, a reimagination of what uh, Zelda 1 Dungeons would, would sound like. I watched some speedruns. And I, uh, yeah, I, I really want to reimagine how, you know, what what if Dun Zelda One had unique dungeon themes for each dungeon, and this was this was my hot take. But this one is very um, how to, how to say it? It's very uh, uh, I forgot the word for it, and I tried to focus on not dying. Non-orthodox for Zelda, right? It doesn't really sound like a Zelda song, but I, I just like the beat. My inspiration for this one is actually Moira's Mask, the uh, Woodfall Temple with the with the drums, and then the rest of the the rest of the songs just appear from itself. It's like once I start to toy with that nice bass line, the rest of the song just grew out from that. But it's a very stressful song. <laughs> oh my goodness, no. We cannot do this. At all. Okay, so this is the Dino Dungeon from now on. Oh, we need to clear this room. Ah! Two hearts! Mm, okay, so we need to be prepared for that. And that was that was a waste. Please don't tell me I'm perma. Okay, no. So these are just temporary. This is our first quest. 
The stress from music is actually helping me right now. And I, I don't know why, but music can really improve your some improve your skills sometimes. I, I'm not joking. And this stress for music is mm, actually helped me with reacting faster or be more prepared, I guess. Ah, oh, map. Okay, guess I, I'm gonna guess I'm gonna do that. Uh, because that is a very traditional thing to do in, in randomized, right? Guess the uh, dungeon shape. But this one, I gotta be honest, seems impossible to guess. What what could this possible be? What is this dungeon? It, it, this, this is like that roar shark test. What, what What do you see? Like, what do you see? The first thing that comes to your mind, what do you see with this shape? Uh, <laughs> imagination, <laughs> come, come back to me. <laughs> I can't really see. No, it, it's just... <laughs> it's nothing. It's a man about to sit down on a chair or something. <laughs> oh. Okay, try my best. Okay, back to the game volume. Oh. There we go. Oh. Uh we should we should I'm writing this down. Uh, south East. Why am I writing in English? Because I'm <laughs> talking English. Uh, brown Forest Dungeon. By the way, we did not, we did not grasp the shiny stone. This nightmare room is back. Oh, did you see that? Tight dodging. It's very scary. <clears throat> yes, Bunk's second stone. I always forgot about you. What was it down here? Oh yeah, nothing. Well, so far Bunk is very lucky with the uh, shiny stones. He's putting them down in his big little leather bag. Or his wallet. He doesn't have an adult wallet. What well, was the first wallet called in Ocarina of Time? Man, it's so much. I really need to replay the games. Oh, a tree. You, 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 man. I, I need to. I need to really uh, get off the computer more. Sorry, not. I'm, I'm gonna continue streaming, but I'm just saying that. Uh, I think. If you have a creative mind, I think you need to be prepared to be bored. Uh, I think you need to, because if you keep your mind busy with uh, worthless stuff like YouTube, and, I mean, sure, you can use YouTube for inspiration stuff, but let's be honest, we all watch utter crap on YouTube, <laughs> utter shit. And uh, it's just bad habits that can, yeah, so, your imagination, I think it can actually uh, get rusty. Um, I, th I think that 
like for now, for example, when I get bored, I I doesn't make I don't make music when I should do that. When I get bored, I should I'm like hmm, maybe I should make some nice you know a nice song or try with a new story and stuff like that. Uh, instead, I just turn on a game, whatever, and oh, I haven't been here for. You know, just killing time. Oh my goodness, no. No! Okay, which one? Oh, okay, nice. I can, I can leave this. So that, that's when we were like, I need to get off my computer because I think creativity and imagination really comes from a mind free from social media and all, all kinds of crap. I'm not saying that being creative you need to be unsocial, <laughs> unsocial, yeah. like, no, you, you don't have to be a lone wolf, you know, to be creative. But I, I think you need to at least avoid having bad habits that steal your time and energy away. Ah, uh, go! Oh, I dodged that. Yes. Oh. Thank you, still poor. But yes, so three. Yeah, you, you saw something that I should have seen with that dungeon shape. I, I like that. And <laughs> you know, people who doesn't share the same kind of imagination, they say, "Ah, that's far fetched." But uh, I don't think so. That actually makes it kind of creepy that we got such a perfect shape for Bunk. Uh, where can I go now? Oh, and I got hit. But we don't need more... Okay, yeah, we have tons of bombs. I could get the boomerang. If I go up there, that's Lost Woods. Uh, this is a teleportation. <gasps> Boom, this to go home. Oh wow, it's a secret entrance. <laughs> okay, we are pretty close. We are very... We are at home. Uh, okay, so... You said close to our home. So it should be somewhere in the forest. No, you you you're gonna you're gonna tell me gibberish if I pay you. Away, scammer! There it is. Show me the power of your metaflex. Yes, <laughs> Bunk's legacy begin from now on. This is a very. <laughs> <laughs> Even though I randomized, this is a very vanilla start. We had the sword, boomerang, bombs. Okay, the book is the only thing, but so far we're doing exactly like <laughs> in the right order. Ah. Now Bunk is all powerful. Now he can find even more shiny stones. <laughs> I, I see him like a this little mischievous little fella in his outfit. Yeah, he's very much like a skull kid. <laughs> now, what happens if I go to the right from the desert? I know there's a bomb spot here. Should I should I go for it? But maybe it's not even here. But I, I know it's one of these screens. <laughs> A bunk is a happy boy now. Yes. Okay, bunk. <coughs> no. No, I'm wasting bombs. Oh. It could be here. It could be anywhere. <laughs> it could be here. Uh. Oh. <laughs> Maybe there's a second quest. Maybe there's the second quest. And I'm. Very much wasting bombs. <gasps> oh, it's on the other side. Wait, really? 
Wait, what? No, I got hit. Oh, I lost my bomb progression. <coughs> Wait, do I really need to go here? No, I don't think there's anything more down this path for me. Come on, Book. This is our call. This is the one thing you should be good at, throwing boomerangs. Uh, I, I was so dead sure that was a bomb spot. But it's probably on the other side. Is it here? <sighs> Brooke's gonna try for it. He's gonna go for it. Oh, what? It was! Okay. That's not the spot I remember. Ooh. Yes. But then again, my memory told me that the blue ring made me white instead of blue, so... <laughs> Uh, okay, big brain moment. Where can I go? What what is the, where's where's the spot I haven't checked yet? Is there a bomb? Is there a one spot? Is there a spot here? I need to get rid of these flying things. Hit. I should use the boomerang here. Oh, come on. Slippery deep head. Maybe this is Bunk's job. Get the rest of these pesky flying fl flowers. <laughs> I really see Bunk like this uh, kind of exile type. Like he's all alone, so he dresses up in smack to seem cool to people. And so they will notice him. <laughs> it is a really sad backstory, but I can't I, I can't help doing it. I just need to <laughs> notice me some point. <laughs> that is bun. The definition of him. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. My memory tells me there's no fire spot here, but we need to be sure. I think that's second quest. But I can't be sure. I can't trust myself. <laughs> Bargus needs to he he was he just wants to find a friend that he can rely on. But we have absolutely to grow more confident. Do we have bomb spots over here somewhere? What? Oh, oh, I almost got hit. I really need the bombs. Oh, whoa, 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 There's a bomb spot here. Here. Oh, my goodness, no. Of all the enemies, though. No? Yeah, I got you. <laughs> now, the, the saddest part of this run, when lore-wise, is gonna be when Bungo enter Bungo. What am I doing? I'm <laughs> I'm changing the name as I play. Bung. No, Bunk. 
How? My brain. <laughs> it's a name I made myself, and I can't even remember it correctly. <laughs> what kind of streamer am I? Bunk, of course. Ugh. You know. What would what, what the lore be when Bunk uh, arrives at the dungeon where his own kin is roaming? That is gonna be... Ugh, that's gonna be heavy. His own tribe. <sighs> Please give me the right one. <laughs> oh, yes. Bunk is disappointed. <laughs> no shine stone. <laughs> I almost got you. <laughs> I don't know why what I was trying there, but I, I I like to be random sometimes. I just a heads up. Random can be really fun if done correctly. I'm not sure if that was correctly, but <laughs> hey, it was something. Um, activate my brain. We have more bomb spots at the coast. This is the truth. Could go for them. I really like it, it started to smell burnt over here because I'm trying to use my brain over there. Where can I go now? That's the that's the lake spot. This is the Lost Wood spot, um, uh, there, there is more bomb spots over there that I miss, probably. I can just teleport over there. That was nothing. Uh -huh. We lost bomb potential. Oh, my, never mind. Wait, so does the counter doesn't... Doesn't reset when I take damage. I thought it was a thing. So after killing 10 or 12 enemies, you're guaranteed a bomb. And I thought that you're guaranteed it if you don't take any hits. No. I'm truly lost. Bunk is, bunk is lost. <laughs> No, oh, at least we can get money. Oh, and we can get the blue ring. Oh, that is a goal. That is a goal. That will make things easier. But I gotta miss Bunk's green outfit is the best. And I love green as well, so. I wonder, by the way, why they went with green rock. Probably it's, probably it's moss covered. Covered moss. Oh no! <gasps> Bunk is f no. Here we go. Bunk's legacy is oh no. Oh, just gonna double check. Nothing. Dante two, which we have checked. And the thing is, 
chat, you're very welcome to correct me because sometimes I assume that, yeah, I have checked this spot and I absolutely haven't. This can happen. There's a fairy up there, right? So I can, I can be... I can afford to be a little bit sloppy. Yeah, here we go. I just, I, see, I really want to find a nice... Uh, we are so prepared for a dungeon, by the way. Uh, but I, I, I have checked in so that... Uh, or have I? Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure that... that uh, silver arrows and such... No, wait. I thought I checked in so that silver arrows only appear in level 9. But I think I changed my mind so I can find them anywhere. I don't think this is a burn spot. <gasps> I want that. Ooh, that was just barely. Am I running around the circus right now? Ah, come on. <laughs> I'm really trying to activate my brain here and Yeah, we have some bomb spots here on the western coast, we gotta fall off that. I just want to find one nice little dungeon. <laughs> Aha! Block with his belly and his finger. <laughs> that was gonna be his belly. <laughs> Bug is the kind of adventure that he's very much not prepared for it, so he's using whatever he has, and he got an iron tummy. <laughs> I don't know, I, I just... There's something about this animation that I love. Uh, north or South? I'll try with South first. <sighs> no, I'm pretty sure I tried this, right? And um, there's nothing. No, that's, that was... And uh, let's see, this wall is the spot that I missed. No. How about this one? No, oh, because I did check that. Okay, there's nothing here. Oh. And why didn't I check both of these screens? Okay, but. Okay, super confirmed. This part of the coast is completely free from. But here, I, I swear there's one here. But where exactly? And I'm out of bombs. <laughs> no, this is the spot. Oh. <laughs> oh. Please give Bunk bombs. He need bombs. <laughs> I can buy more, but there's also the, this nice prospect of having the blue ring. Uh, I'm pretty sure I can find the red ring as well. So yeah, I think we're gonna buy bombs. Although we have we have slain quite the amount of enemies. No. See, as, as soon as I'm... When I'm carefree and I'm not focusing on anything, I, 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 I deal with these enemies with ease. But now that I'm so... I don't want to take damage. I, I become extra cautious and... 
in that way I become even worse and make mistakes I would <laughs> I wouldn't do usually. Ah, okay, I was very lucky there. I really want new bumps. <laughs> okay, this is good for Bunk. I'm gonna have to take a water pause. And um, I'm not gonna close down the stream, but man, I need to drink water. That is something that <laughs> gamers really should <laughs> be mindful of that, to have water next. Because that's one thing that I can easily forget. I can, I can, I can be parched while playing games, and I and I don't even notice it. Like suddenly, I feel like a mummy. Like, <laughs> <laughs> yes, cat minion, you you you're way more structured than I am. <sighs> oh. <laughs> Bunk is hitting the tree frustration. <laughs> I have no bumps. <laughs> I'm not finding more shiny stones. No? <laughs> Cheer up, Bunk. You're gonna find progress soon. But we know there's a bomb spot in the coast. I just completely missed it several times over. So, I guess we're gonna go and buy... We need to buy bombs. This can take it forever. No! Oh, why didn't... <laughs> now we absolutely need to find... We need to buy bombs. So, it's also kind of frustrating that I, the desert one, am I, oh, the blue ring, I'm so sorry, but it, it, it called for progression, and maybe I haven't even found all the fire spots, that is also very, a, a big possibility. <laughs> But yeah, I think we need to go to the mountains. I think we have, I think we have more, a bigger chance of progress over there. Oh wait, no, no, this is not the teleport. So we're here. Why are Paul's voice immune to bombs? Wrong spot. Bunk does it? No. <laughs> okay. I found that spot. Oh, that was close. Here. Is there a spot to here? Oh my goodness. No, why did I? <laughs> oh, in my desperation. <laughs> I should have used some bombs first. But there's also lots of enemies. Oh. <laughs> that, that is... <laughs> this is panic dance. Trying to get to, to the ladder. <laughs> I am, I'm in character now. Do I do I suspect bombs over here? Yes. Oh, of course not. It could be here. No, it could be here. Oh yes, okay. Oh dungeon! Oh for this one. Okay. No wait. Wrong volume. Is 
The only song I have is uh, this one. Way more fitting. I, I, I got, I'm gonna see this as, a, as the ice dungeon. Uh, okay, there we go. There we go. Uh, right away, we need a key. See? But we have a key. It's a level 8 as well. Oh, scary stuff. Oh! <laughs> Run, bunk. Okay, we don't have to worry about <laughs> Bunk being hosted to his own tribe, but this is way more creepier than I expected. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we can deal with this room, but it's gonna be... <laughs> this feels weird. <laughs> this feels really weird. <laughs> Die, pesky human. But the thing is, this is this is Bug's friend, or like his friend. Maybe this is a wild, this is wild like likes, and at, at home is Bug's pet, like like. No oh, wait, what? Oh, we'll see it. It cued the songs. Okay, there we go. Bombs! We really need the bombs. I, I wasted bomb. I, I could have used one bomb there, but also it's, it's full of families. But we're gonna take this. Please don't be a locked door in the next room. Or even worse, like a river, like a ladder locked. Yes. Punk is making progress. Punk is making the worst kind of progress. Oh my god! <laughs> I can imagine this scene. Bunk is entering a new cave, straight up the ass of a big dead hydra. <laughs> I can't do this. I mean, I, if if Bunk uses bombs, maybe. No, I'm just kidding because bomb doesn't work. Oh, this is bunk. Bunk is scary. He has, he all he wants to do is just find shiny stones, and now he's fighting a hydra. <laughs> Once one head started flying, that's when it's gonna be impossible. <laughs> At least, I mean, impossible as of now. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, the D pad. I really didn't want to go up there. I was weird. I, I, why is bomb not working for this one? Ah, oh, scary big head. Oh, Bug is scared. Ow! Oh, that dodging. No! This is it. I need to. F I need to. Yes. Oh my goodness. Bug, are you still alive? You're still fighting. I can tell you. It's even worse now that I'm getting sweaty. <laughs> and sweat. <laughs> oh my. No! Oh. Oh, so close, Bunk. I don't think I can explore this one 
Kind of more. Yeah, that was. What? What? If, what if I was one hit away? Oh, it feels like so. Oh. So many, so many dungeons. Not a single. I don't. I don't think I haven't found a single dungeon item. This is problematic. Uh, here I am absolutely not sure if there's a bomb spot or not. Leave a space. Oh, and there's so many Lionels ahead of me. Oh, wait, I need to, need to stop the music. Okay, back to Bunk's adventure. And not Bunk, Bunk. I need to. There's the English version to say Bank, but no, it's Bunk. She's it. I know it's dungeon level 9 is at this right place for some reason. So we're at, we're at the wrong end of this. We have several bombs. So I'm, I'm pretty sure there is no bomb spot here. Teleport. Hmm, have I checked the white? No, wait, I don't think we can find... No, we already found the, yes, the, uh, the statue item, which was the book. Hmm. So I don't think... I don't think... No, I can't find more. So we're done with that. <laughs> Maybe? Just maybe. Yes. I mean arrows, but it would be nice to have arrows ready in case I find them. It costs money to fire the bow, though. Precious shiny stones. Do not steal from Bunk. I'm pretty sure there's a bomb over here. But pretty sure it's not 100% sure. No, no, stupid boomerang. Oh, I wanted to use. Mm. Yes! Because, yeah. See, I, I, I have some kind of system. Because I did remember that I tried this spot. But we have this one as well. Somebody's got a case of the Mondays. What? This community is the worst thing ever. <laughs> I, I, I don't understand anything. <laughs> oh, what is that? Book is smelling secret cave. But then again, Bunk is wearing a mask. So there is no cave. <laughs> Bunk has no nose. He <laughs> it just dawned on him. <laughs> Sorry, uh, as, uh, I, I didn't need to apologize for my English grammar is not the best because I, I forget stuff. I think they established this tiny little detail about me that I forget stuff. <laughs> Oh, I wanted a bomb so badly. Okay. Maybe here. No. Here. Ah, oh, crap. Oh, it could be here. But it's not. <laughs> Bunks, bombs. <laughs> Since today's Sunday. Oh, wait. I did not reflect on that at all. That is eerily precise. Well, arms precise, but so is, is this a bomb spot? Bunk, can you smell it? Ah, 
Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, autocorrect can be real confusing. These, I think, never drop anything, so they're... I'm getting a little scared. I really don't know where progress is, other than, other than grinding money. If I had to be completely honest. There's so many things are now locked behind. Locked doors. And bombs. But there's a thing. Have I checked every tree spot? This was more tricky than I expected to be. But I need more bombs, that's for sure. Maybe one of you. <laughs> They're also very, very disturbing <laughs> detail. Like bump. He starts with a boomerang and then just pushes them to the wall and finishes them off. <laughs> it's like gruesome scene when you think about it. <laughs> Okay, here's to Gannon's place. Nothing. Unless there is a bomb at the arrow spot. I mean, if there's a bomb location. Oh. See, if I was more systematic about things, then I would not run around like I'm doing right now. But I think we can, we can all be so very... Extremely happy that we found the sword. We managed to find the sword. I guess the blue ring can help. Was uh, this was nothing? I uh, hear I, I and the red can it would be so nice. Like, th that tree very much looks like a burn spot, but it's not. It's a... Trickery tree. Trickery tree! <laughs> Bunk is lost. <laughs> He's lost in the lost woods. <laughs> that would, that would, be, would he be his big weakness. He's... His adventure will absolutely stop at the Lost Woods. <laughs> we'll wander around there forever. We check the dead end. I guess we... Yeah, the, the, we had the coast. No! We have the coast. Ooh. So that's one bomb, but for that we need a bomb. And I, I, mm, mm. But yes, I, I, I do love how the randomizer makes they, they makes keys more viable because sometimes a dungeon is directly locked, and it works for for Zelda one at least. Bunk's only friend in this world. I would really love a mix of the level. Oh yes, the level design of uh, the dungeon design of uh, Ocarina of Time and mixed with uh, Zelda One's open world map. That's difficult. I'm not even sure that's possible. Okay, so we can now head for the head for the coast. Uh. Book is not having a good time right now. Ah. Uh. 
Clumsy. Oh, thank you. I, I, I try my best. I really try to go through my mind. What kind of spots have I missed? I mean, we have... We haven't even... We have found, like, what, three dungeons? Out of <laughs> eight? No, if you if you don't count uh, Ganos. I mean, we're, 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 we're... Oh, my goodness, the wrath spots. Oh... I think the wrath spots are absolutely filled with dungeons. Funny if I if I forgot that I didn't check the first cave, the original first uh, sword cave. <laughs> it, it's gonna be stuff like that. It's gonna be no. It's gonna be face palm deluxe because that, that's that's me in a nutshell. <laughs> That was a nice throw. Oh. Ledger of Bunk. And the quest for the magical boomerang. Plus shining stones. <laughs> I, the Triforce is absolutely an optional thing. <laughs> that would be so fun if, if the Triforce was an optional quest. No? It's the magical boomerang that Bunk seeks the most. <laughs> Okay, so here's a sp I'm pretty sure here should be a bomb spot. I if it's not, then I'm gonna buy some. Okay. Oh, on the first try. Oh, I'm so lucky. Come on. No, I'd rather say for this is not direct progress. And now's the question, is there a cave here? I'm gonna guess no. Is there a cave here? No. No, wait. That's the thing, right? I haven't, I have, I have checked this. I have checked this. And this. Book alone. I, I mean, it, it's just it's just this one spot that I have missed, simply missed, and it's it's probably gonna contain the biggest kind of progress so far. I'm pretty sure there is no cave here. And again, <laughs> that's the word we're gonna keep coming back to, I'm pretty sure. Oh, no, I don't have the big shield. Sorry, the big belly. <laughs> yes, he's invisible she. No, it's just, it's just belly. It's just his belly that, that keeps defecting stuff. I can imagine him like a you know like closing eyes looking away like and then his belly manages to deflect the damage. <laughs> Book is scared. Okay, so we have opened that. Uh, that was the one I was unsure about the dead end. So dead end is not one hundred percent checked. Hmm. Wait a second here. Ah. Thank you. Wait, what? Oh, wow, so they're still flying. <laughs> so the, the time, the watch doesn't work on these ones. Hmm. Interesting detail. Oh, we need a power bracelet. I think here, we found the book here, right? I just need to triple check because... 
I think there's a bomb spot here. We could be completely wrong about that. Bunk is not afraid to try. It's gonna be sad because it's gonna lose all his bombs. No, that's not where I wanted to put it. Spending bomb potential. <gasps> nope, I did not randomize that. <laughs> oh, that would be in. Okay, oh, I, we need to remember this. Uh, so. North. West. Master Sword. That one we can forget about, and I, I, comp I totally forgot about it. Okay, here, hmm. bomb potential. Come on, come on. No, I'm not gonna do it again. <laughs> oh, the misery. <sighs> The seed I was playing on, the last seed before the stream, uh, playing on my own, that one was so good. And this one's just evil. Oh, oh, there's a bomb spot here. That, it just hit me. But I'm, oh, I'm so sure. Please drop one. Drop bombs. Oh my goodness, okay, I, 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 I think it is here. I, I'm pretty sure it's here. I'm pretty sure it's here. Yes! Poor <laughs> book. Uh, and up there... I'm just triple checking. I'm just triple checking. Because I think we, then we can really... Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah. This was the cannon spot. Oh, such memories. Bunk's first cannon. His first item. He no longer... had to be afraid of the dark. Because he found his cannon. Okay, yeah, we are completely done with the uh, Northwest. <sighs> At this point, I gotta need to call for friends or something. Oh, I do remember this. So, yeah, the waterfall was a scammer. Total scammer. Oh. <laughs> Bunks barely can deflect anything. <laughs> Maybe he dreams to be a... Maybe he really wants to be a Goron. So he has been practicing exercising. I mean... If, if, if there's a bomb spot here, then I will be very surprised. Because I have no memory whatsoever. No... It doesn't really feel like it. Just maybe. And then we have this pesky little spot. 
Oh. I just want to be 100% sure you're just going to burn these corners and then I'm going to be off. How about this one? So I think chat, I, I think at this point, and I say chat, I mean, so far chimney, tree, cat, I mean, a cat, I mean, uh, yeah, at this point, <laughs> if you know, oh, if you know I have a missed a spot, because I'm getting desperate, I'm getting desperate, I really don't know if I but that, that's the thing that's what makes me so unsure because I'm not 100% sure that I know every single location to find uh, all the burn and bomb spots and maybe maybe I do need to visit one of the dungeons and at least try to clear and that means buying a crap ton of keys <laughs> oh. <laughs> Above and below the area with the bridge to regular level 1. Wait, what? You know, I have a faint memory that we've discussed this before, or I. It shocked me. So, yeah, so you're saying this spot. I've been having a hunch about this, but I... Oh, was that quest 1? Or quest 2, I mean. I have no clue whatsoever. See, because this spot, I'm so very unsure of. I, I I can't even you know because most of my memory tells me like oh yeah this this spot I know there's a secret door somewhere but this so this spot I oh my goodness why well, I never checked that spot <laughs> see I I would have never found that because oh yeah I didn't remember that and it's a uh, I mean there's a key there's a key. <laughs> At this point, I but there's also the blue, the blue, the blue ring, the blue ring. I think we want to be blue instead. Okay, so I got, I'm gonna write that because that's gonna be our key spot. So below dungeon one, key and the original dungeon. Okay, so oh by the way, yeah, we have a key spot outside our home as well, so. Okay, and yeah, and, and this spot, for example, no, I I, I have no rec My brain t tells me that no, there is no burn spot here. But you're telling me there is. And that is, that is amazing, because that means I had never ever found this one. One of the green ones. Oh, my goodness. See, and, and that's the problem. I watched Pro, Europe, Pro Jared pl play this. <laughs> And I, I can't even remember that. Because as soon as I play this, and I have an audience, I go back to my own memories. I don't know, because my brain... Hmm... Oh my... And it's a dungeon! Holy moly. Okay, and so many doors. Me, me. Hello? Oh, uh, not again! <laughs> <laughs> poor, <laughs> poor, <laughs> poor Bunk again. <laughs> He's walked through the room. <laughs> <It's> <laughs> twice. Oh. Bug. 
the unluckiest adventurer. See, this is why his nose is brown. <laughs> Please do not draw that, everyone. Please do not draw that. <laughs> okay, you're carrying bombs, that's good to know. Uh, oh, here's the blue ones. I'm gonna, I'm absolutely gonna try bomb that. Wall. Oh my god, waste robes! <laughs> and the blue ones. Oh, that was a hell room. That was a death room. <laughs> His nose is really brown. <laughs> oh, wow, there was sex. Oh, that scared me. <laughs> oh. What can I do here? Clear this room? Yeah, 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 yeah. Even better. No, I don't have any keys. Oh, I thought I had it. I think I think dungeon four is the is the one dungeon. So I'm just gonna get this one. Oh, three hearts. No oh, book. My bombs. <laughs> uh, blue ring, absolutely. More keys. I am so key locked, it's insane. Oh, wait, I didn't, I didn't go south here. Okay, bunk. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, I'm raft locked. <laughs> no. Would it be funny if I actually found a raft here? That would be very much Zelda design. Proper Zelda dungeon design. And down there is a dragon. No, we have. We don't have enough la hell for that. Okay, so I can't believe I even above D O one is Dungeon Four. I haven't I I I I completely forgot the other dungeons. And then the desert question: Is there a bomb spot here out in the desert? Stay tuned to find out. <laughs> the thing is that if I spend money getting the blue ring, I will almost certainly f directly instantly find the red ring I'm that th that would be so typical bunk luck so is it even should I even waste money on that and now with all these new burn spots I mean I it could be anywhere That's one thing I love this randomizers. There's always something that that seems so incredibly uh, that it happened. For example, how Bunk managed to get get <laughs> arrive at the ass of a dragon twice. No? That is just the unluckiest little fellow. Uh, I have absolutely tried this wall. I have, I know I have. Yeah. 
This means that I should probably revisit some dungeons and really try to do them. First keys. And that means... What was the best key spot? So below dungeon 1 entrance. Ah, oh, bung! No! Bunk! Be so helpful. No, I don't have the big shield. Why did I? <laughs> Poor Bunks. <laughs> well, it's not strong enough. Like this place. This place also smells like a burn spot, but it probably isn't. And if I would have the red can, then I will. I will. It would be so much faster, this. <laughs> yeah, but this is what we did back in the days. Every single tree tested with a cannon. Or at least if we didn't do it then someone maybe our parent or a sibling did it. <laughs> uh, okay, where am I going now? Dungeon one, that's it. Key. Buy keys. Screw the blue ring. We need keys. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Uh, very sloppy work. Ooh, five rupees. Like this. This could be very much a burn spot somewhere, but again, it doesn't feel like so, but again, it could be that I just never... It was a spot I never really cared much about. Alright, Cat Minion. Money. Sydney, you need to help me again. <laughs> help, bang, bunk! Oh, my goodness, my brain. Oh, it's getting late, that's why. I need to eat dinner soon. You know? <laughs> Left. I, I, I can't believe. How? You got a gift. <laughs> you are bunk's friend. So I know lots of the dungeons I found. Oh, here we go. Here is. Can I close the dungeon one? So below dungeon one, here's the key shop. I'm gonna buy two of these. And then we're gonna relocate the dungeons. I could get the shield though. But it could also get eaten. I think we spare off the keys. Okay. 
Okay, so now we need to f we need to find Bug's home. Teleport. Like this, the, oh, this spot, it, it reeks of a burn spot. It reeks. Or maybe it doesn't. Ah! No, no, not a single one. But what if that's a trick? <laughs> this is gonna take a while. Man, I have no idea if there's a burn spot to here. And this can take a while, but. I mean, since it really, I, I just have no memory whatsoever of this being a spot for a serve. But I think we can, yeah, I can trust myself. Southeast Brown Forest. So we have done into. Okay, we're gonna check that out. So that is that is on my note. Southeast Brown Forest is where I found Dungeon Two. I mean, gosh, we didn't go for that. And we we have bombs and we have two keys. We are we're gonna do this. Oh, if, if I mean if if I'm if I'm gonna find the Lion Key. That's gonna be amazing. And boring at the same time. And I know that some people look at that, yeah, but isn't that just a time waste? You just grind money to get the keys. Oh my goodness. I'm getting all the bombs now. I mean yeah, I mean if if you be if you if you turn on your logic, that's what the address is. But uh, I mean you can do that for so many things. Like buying candy, that is not very logical, it's unhealthy, and costs money, money they can spend on something else, but at the same time, you know, candy can, you know, candy can absolutely make a, you know, spending your time together with your friends, you're gonna play some games, you're gonna have some candy, you know, it's gonna, it's gonna be an, it's just an, it's gonna add a nice feeling to it, and so, it, it's not really you spending money, it's you, yeah, and <laughs> I'm really trying to make sense here. Uh, so the whole thing with that, the keys really just being a waste of time, it's not, because it's, it's part of the RPG, it's part of the explore the world. So if I go to a dungeon and just a lock key and I, I just, I don't know, it just, it just forces me to go out to the world and find a key shop and when I do it it's uh, you know uh, there it is wait or was I done with this no I was absolutely not done with this I swear it's gonna be a bomb spot above me there we go I mean I oh I, I do like the Ocarina of Time, or more like Link's Awakening, where every dungeon had its own unique set of keys. But I gotta say that I... Oh, this one was a ladder dungeon. Big time ladder dungeon. Ah, oh, sorry, I'm so focused on this right now. Oh.
you know, sure, a, a dungeon would be cooler if the, ah, here's a locked door and you find the key only in the dungeon. In Zelda 1, you can just go and buy an extra key. I don't know, it's just a nice little touch that you really need to... Oh my goodness! The damage! I, I'm... Okay, I can't, I can't get hit. I can't get hit by him. Oh, this is a most problematic room. No. <laughs> Come on, look. Unk. <sighs> oh, no. One step closer. Oh, no, that was sore from above. above. Okay, now I'm gonna say we haven't done it for a while. Oh, 11. That number is gonna pile up. <laughs> oh. So Dungeon 2 really doesn't feel like one I could clear. But I, I'm gonna try anyway. Oh, thank you. Exactly what I need. Ah! Yeah. Because I, I think I think my progress is now locked behind a dungeon. There's just, just no doubt about it. <laughs> I need to find a good dungeon item. I swear the next one's gonna be like the bow or something, which is not gonna directly help me. But the raft or the leather, mm, that would be amazing. Oh yeah, why not? Uh, wait, maybe one of you can drop a fair or something? I need it. And, I mean, sure, we have also the dragon. The, the dragon. What kind of pronounce? How am I pronouncing it? The dragon. We can defeat that one. Oh, sorry, Hydra. And we have two of them. And, but for them, I absolutely would really like the blue ring. <laughs> Either that or the blue, the, the white sword. Would it be funny if these two, no sorry, even three rooms south here are all invisible secret rooms and I can just bomb my way down south there. Oh yeah. Okay, we can skip this. This one, this room is... Mm, it's not fun. Ah, oh, no! Oh, ooh, that was so close. <laughs> ah, saved by the lag. I got saved by the lag. Yes, boom, with the sick... Boomerang froze! Ah! Oh, thank you. Oh, oh I... <laughs> I got surrounded. I thought it was gonna throw to the left. Please drop a fair or something. This one's gonna drop the clock now. Watch this. Oh no, a uh, heart. Uh, I can take that. Oh yeah. We actually need this. And we can actually the bomb to the left as well. Okay. But I can't screw this up. You can walk over rocks. Stones. Okay, that was easy. There's two down. Yes. 
Yes. Come on. Yes! Oh. Okay, even though there's no direct progress, that is... Oh. That is so nice. <sighs> Go get him. Bunk. Ah, yes. <laughs> so that key is after the worthless. Good to know. Unless those enemies in there are gonna drop. Actually, I, I want... I think these tiny ones can actually drop items now. No. The poor one shivering in fear. Yes! Okay, everyone. Praise. We need... Come on, Bunk, you can do this. Get the courage, go down the stairs. It's a teleport. Yeah. Maybe that can be Bunk's legacy. He he wants to be a master boomerang thrower. Oh yes. And now you drop me a heart. No. Wow, this is interesting. Oh, we, oh, we're here. Yes, we're in the boomerang throw dungeon. <laughs> Gliok lurks near the desert. Near the desert. Near. Oh yeah, I, I think I know. Okay, so. Uh, near this. I think that was Dungeon 8. Gliok. Wait, wait, wait. I already found the Dungeon item. It is. A, it was a sword. And I think I got the... Yeah, I think I got the Trifrost Mirror as well, so... And I don't think I've enabled so that... Oh my goodness. But wait, no. There's also the dungeon room. No, no, no. There's still a dungeon item here. We need to, def we need to defeat this. And I don't know how... Okay. Lots of damage. Uh, no. No! <laughs> Boom. <laughs> No, oh, no, 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 that was stupid of me, sorry. <laughs> Shouldn't have, I forgot. You know what? Uh, I will be right back. I'm gonna write in chat. Beer, be water. I really, trust me, I'm going to have a setup where I will have a nice interface and all, and so I can really put up a nice, like, pause menu. But I'm, I'm going to take a pause here. I'm going to maybe even prepare dinner. But I'm also going to get water. <laughs> Lots of water. So, be back later. I will be around. And...
ho, hej, ho, ho. <laughs> Fell asleep in the shower. I have never done that. <laughs> of all the things. Oh no, wait, my control died. Oh, falling asleep in the shower. No, 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 no. And no, I did not forget to stream, but my water break became a quick dinner. Quote unquote, quick. <laughs> oh boy. There we go. Ah, uh, no, that's the worst thing, you know, because if something happens to me, and with me being this, uh, <laughs> with me being this, uh, uh, what's the word for it? Not optimistic, not uh, opportunist. Ah, come on, brain. Oh, it's at the tip of my tongue. Ah, no, I can't do it. But, uh, <laughs> streamer gone missing on stream. Well, streamers have done worse things. But si since I, I changed my mind so fast, that for this example, I was just going to go for a quick break, but no. I was, I was like, hey, I can, I can make a dinner. Which, by the way, was... Uh, I made curry shrimp. It was pretty nice. And... Uh, that's going to be the problem. Because people are going to assume that I just, you know, done something random and wandered off. So w when something do happens to me, something... Uh, like an emergency or something. Like people's gonna be like shrugging about me. Eh. <laughs> he's probably he's probably lost somewhere or forgot about the stream. But no, it is very much alive. An adventure of bunk continues. <laughs> oh, I was thinking about the backstory with bunk. And and with the, is it Goira? I, I sorry, I need to I need to go Google the name. Uh, Legend of Zelda. Oh, whoops. Boomerang enemy. Is it? It's Gorillas. Gorillas. Maybe Gorillas. So, we all know that the boomerang Gorias has been changed to Lynx, right? Maybe there could be a piece of story where... Where poor Bunk is so trauma traumatized going in dungeons. And they all look like... So, he he's meeting Link in the future. And he see him as an enemy because... He got so traumatized by them in this... <laughs> in this world. <laughs> Because they all look like Link. Uh, oh boy. There's lots of lore potential here. Yeah? So, yeah, for those who were away, uh, before I went to my quick dinner session, uh, we are exploring Dungeon 2. And I have found the White Sword. But there's more to the dungeon. So we're going back. And I think we're gonna fight the dragon. But we need full health first. Sorry, Hydra, no dragon. <sighs> I, I I miss when, when Bunk was a very Afraid and insecure little being, you know, with having no gear at all, and just try to dodge everyone just that tries to get him. You know, maybe they are all his monster friends that have gone hostile for some reason, and you no know, bunks try to find out what's happening. But I, I do miss when when Bunk had no weapons. Uh, we're gonna try for it. Uh, chimney, quickie, or. Or anyone. Left, right, middle. 
Left, right, middle, left, right, middle. At this point, I, I, I mean, we're gonna make a whole fan game, fan-made game, with with the legend, the legend of Bunk. Wow, you both picked right. <laughs> Shit, fail me. <laughs> you have failed me for the last time. <laughs> The magic has worn off them. <laughs> All that money. <laughs> See, chat? Cat minion, he, he will not have picked right. <laughs> oh. And now we're gonna have... I, I think it's gonna be so typical that I gotta say something like, oh yeah, I, I will do better than Shat next time. And I'm gonna get like minus 90 or something. <laughs> okay, I keep, I, I think we're gonna keep digging in Dungeon 2. I mean, this sword upgrade is everything. Uh, extra bombs when I don't need it. <laughs> For Graver Streamer. I am the big streamer. <laughs> I mean, that's also one thing with with uh, celebrities. Like, I I I have no problem with you know people, people people. What? Yeah, my my tongue. I need to <laughs> people, <laughs> not people. <laughs> uh, you know, enjoying my uh, my stream. I'm actually also grabbing the whole affi uh, uh, Twitch affiliate uh, thing. It's gonna take a while because it's weekend, so it can't be finished right now, but it's, it's happening. But uh, I, I, I wouldn't want people to, you know, like, oh, I, I, I can't make a day without watching some Celeste Glory. I don't, I don't want to become a celebrity where people, you know, worship me. I. Uh, because that can quickly become an unhealthy thing. Do do everything in uh, hmm, lagomt. I got that's a really good Swedish word. <laughs> Finally, emo time. Yes, the blue wrist robe is coming. <laughs> and bunk. We're gonna have a bunk emo body. Ah, life is so much easier with a. A better sword. The white sword is mightier than the wooden sword. <laughs> Wisdom quote of the day. Um, I I could have gone for. I'm gonna go for it anyway. No, of course not. Oh, that one went for it. Oh, oh, punk, punk, touch, touch. Poor, this poor bunk, this is stressing him out. Uh, where's the Hydra? Where's the Triforce? Sorry, the Shiny Stone. <coughs> oh, Vire! My goodness, Jimmy. You know me better than me. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Poor bunk. <laughs> What's up here? Oh yeah, and then we've got a lucky streak with this one. That, that's where we got the uh, white sword. I I managed to ace those uh, dodongos, and we could take. But we no, yeah, we have we have. Oh yeah, so oh, that's that's right. That's a useless key. <sighs> Relax, I know I got this. And this was just a teleportation one. Yeah. Oh, 
Oh, I haven't gone here. <gasps> and yeah. But there's no staircase, so I don't think this is gonna be a key item. Oh! <laughs> key item dropping here. Maybe a key itself, but. So I do have to push them in a specific direction. That is uh, interesting. Ah, see. The boomerang hero, Bunk. Another useless locked door. Sorry, not key, locked door. So that must be... is that... No, uh, wait, now Guma is, is dungeon, is level 8. Griok lurks near this... Watch out, bug! Oh yeah, 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 okay, this is what I wanted to... <laughs> All for the com... just for this, just the compass. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay, that means we are not able to clear this dungeon yet. Or maybe we already have. Because I, I really don't know how mixed up the dungeon items are. <coughs> Bunk and his bunker egg. <laughs> it's like, I don't know, something, something is so adorable with him. I have yet to find Dungeon 1, which is interesting. It's the raft. I mean, sure, so many dungeons get stopped behind the raft, but... Uh... Well, what about that path? Down there to the left. I could try to bomb to the left here. There we go. Oh yeah, oh, that's right. But oh, wait a second. It's the middle one to the left, right? So this room should not contain a secret staircase, unless they had decided to change that room. Pretty sure I tried this room as well with the staircase, but who knows? I think we should put that as a note. Oh my goodness, no. <laughs> Poor Bunker used to. He's trying to find the shiny stones. No? He means no harm, but he's self-defense. No? Oh. Huh. That's, that's right, so we... I can go... By the way, that's a... 
Oh, I'm so stupid. That's the entrance of the dungeon. <laughs> okay, I guess we'll go near the desert. We got a lead. Thank you. Uh, I can take this path. Da -da 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 -da. Da -da. Nope. Oh, I mean, how many dungeons? This <laughs> is on these raft locations. How many are there, by the way? At least two with with. With the entrance. Oh, there we go. That was a lucky hit. It will be interesting if, if because we have in this this is River Sora, and the Sora in Ocarina of Time, the friendly one, is the Sea of Sora. But it begs the question why they are so different in looks. Hmm? If they're supposed to be the same species. Hmm? Or maybe it's the uh, Hy Hyrule people who is really bad at naming stuff. Hmm? <laughs> Alright, so. <coughs> the bomb. The bomb location in the desert. Is that evil thing? I don't know. Could be here. Oh! That was not mine. Nah. It doesn't really feel like... It, it feels like it must be second quest. But you think that desert would be a really nice spot to hide a secret entrance, but... Uh, mm -hmm. Maybe Miyamoto really hates deserts. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> oh. Wait, w was this even a dungeon, by the way? But near the desert... I assume they meant this location. No? And it's near the desert, so it doesn't feel like the bomb location is in the desert. Uh, okay, 100% sure that's not the thing. Uh, no. Okay, bomb bless again. If I had a power bracelet. Yeah, at this point, I mean, what is what is the definition of near the desert? How far away from the desert can I be? I'm gonna shake these again, just so I'm, so I'm sure. Nope, it's a scammer. And this was... I could get the shield. Or in this case, a sturdier belly. <laughs> Come on. Okay. Money making game. Okay. We're gonna see if I'm better at this. Mm, left. Okay. Not a big reward, but it was great. <laughs> One desert entrance may require an item you don't have yet, depending on... Yeah, I think the overworld is first quest. 
but what on earth do you mean with an item I don't have yet? Wait, the board, the book? No. No, I have the book, by the way. I think at this point we're going back to... See, here's the problem. I I know that we have a dungeon with the uh, two-headed Hydra. Oh, where was that again? <laughs> Quick, check my notes. It's incomplete. Uh, oh yeah, above above the first dungeon was dungeon four, but was that the one with the three-headed Hydra or the two-headed one? And right now, it's really standing still in my head. What item am I missing that I need for a desert entrance? I don't... the flute? If that is that the case, that I have never ever opened up this, that entrance before. I only know the lake position for the flute. <laughs> I don't... I didn't know about the desert one needing that as well. Alright, let's dig here a little bit more. Uh, the hider is probably down there. <laughs> let's check the rest of the base. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, my. Wombalom. This is the one with the. Ah. Oh. Ah, oh, bombs, thank you. Goodbye. Please. Okay, this is doable. And another key. Ah, a punk, a punk! Use your... <laughs> the item of hero. Punk, use it. <laughs> Would be even better if the magic boomerang was able to... Do some damage, like the one in uh, Orc of Seasons. <coughs> that is one nice boomerang. We should have like a. Ah, oh, come on, really? I think the invisible entrance, that's the one in second quest, right? So I don't think... Oh! Oh! There's probably an important item there. And... Oh! <laughs> Bunk is very scared. Bunk doesn't like this. <laughs> Icky tentacle hands trying to grab me. But he do... It's the shiny stones he wants. <laughs> the power bracelet. Oh. Oh, thank you so much. Oh. <laughs> Progress. <laughs> oh. I mean, I can beat this. Uh, what? Uh. <laughs> I got stuck. It's stuck. Ow. And they hurt. So we got the dungeon item. Oh my. Ah, no. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Bunk. <laughs> okay. Oh, this is a boss dungeon. Effect. Run, Bunk. <laughs> What's in here? Hello. <gasps> Oh, ooh, that was that was baited me. Hello. So so weird rooms. Should I? No. And I I know it's highly possible that I should go that I can below. 
But I, I, I want to try to defeat this one. Can drop something nice. Probably won't be able to look. Oh! All for nothing. <laughs> Poor bug. When he when he real becomes heroic, and he really tries, he gets nothing for it. Huh? So higher up there, that's certain death. Can I even go back? Did I get locked out or something? <laughs> I mean, I guess I could try with these ones, even though they are very scary beings. And tanky! A map would be nice. So we have the boomerang dungeon. I try to be as thematic as possible. So try to forget my suggestion for the last dungeon name. That almost was. <laughs> that was a meme one. No, not even a meme one. It's just that. Try to be funny. Ah, oh, absolutely nothing. <laughs> No secret entrance. It should be. There's a rule, right? The middle one is always the middle one to the left. So it should be this one, which is not so. Or is the middle one right? Nope. Oh, that's right. I got the bar probably now. We're up! Scary room! <laughs> Oh, yeah, I am locked. <laughs> oh, my deep pad. <laughs> Book. No. I think it's better if we save because I. Yeah, yeah, we're saving. Because now we have more things to explore. Go, Bunk, go. And now I can save money for the the blue ring. I, I promise you, I'm gonna find the blue ring, and in the next room I'm gonna find the red one. No, I'm gonna buy the blue ring, and in the next next dungeon I walk into, it's gonna be the red ring. Ah, uh, no, okay. Please tell me steal a thing. Please tell me steal a thing. They can't do me like this. Bunk. Use your strength. <laughs> okay, maybe that's what I needed. What? No. Yeah, okay. Oh, of course. Oh. <laughs> oh, I gotta try another song for this one. Hold a second here. This one, I, I will try the uh, my hectic song. I don't know why, because it's green, but uh, I have a demo for another one. Even though this song I, I wrote for more like a fire level. And also this one is just a demo, so it's not a finished one. Uh, uh, there it is. Okay, Bunk. Let's do this. He's almost camouflaged in here.
So many bombs. Oh, quick, we can. Okay, up is worthless. I'm not gonna make it, am I? Oh, wait, I am if I... Okay, at least I didn't waste that bomb. <laughs> Consider what you said earlier about pushing blocks and what you just did. I completely forgot. I'm so very sorry. <laughs> See, this is why I need a chat, like in desperate need of a chat. Because my brain will absolutely dump information very quickly if it if it sees it fit. Poor Bunk. <laughs> He's just a scared little <laughs> Goraya. Is it Goraya? I'm gonna say Goraya. Oh my goodness. I have bomb potential. I'm gonna save the bomb because we have two extra. It's gonna stay there, I think. Oh, here we go. <gasps> no! It's the. Oh, it's the boomerang imposters. They are. They're using the boomerang without having done the. Following the legend of the boomerang, like Bunk did. <laughs> I don't know. I'm really trying to <laughs> come up with that sort of. Sort of story on the go <laughs> you can only be one boomerang master this one though should be easier <laughs> I gotta have like a kind of like a giant worm but what's that oh maybe, oh, maybe it's the jaw of the uh, you know what? It kind of looks like the monsters from. Do you remember those flying larva monsters from from inside Jabu Jabu's belly? I know it, it might be a stretch, but <laughs> it's the best thing I can come up with. This is my favorite dungeon so far. Oh, forget what I said. Forget everything I said about this being my favorite dungeon. This is <laughs> no, oh no, <laughs> poor punk. No. This is, I mean, it, this is a big stretch. It's a giant stretch, and it was. <laughs> No. <laughs> that was very cruel. <laughs> that was a very cruel dungeon. <laughs> Alright, but we haven't explored everything, so... Right? At least I don't think so. Yeah, yeah we can go other directions. Wait, those can actually drop a bomb, if I'm lucky. Oh! So yeah. I, I did say that randomizer sometimes makes the uh, layout or design of the dungeons more interesting. Uh, sorry, I need to shake something. It's a very loud song, isn't it? But in the in, in this, I mean, this done is a prime example of a game designer. Well, mistake if they, yeah, because I, 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 I got stuck because I didn't have the bow. So obviously we, we'll, we will find stuff like this in a randomizer. <laughs> so it's not perfect. <laughs> OK, 
Okay, what's in here? Oh, it's a nightmare room. Uh, that's probably gonna give me the raft or something. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, it's so laggy. <laughs> Screw this. <laughs> Bunk is the hero who always take the easiest way out. <laughs> that is safe and sorry. That is Bunk's motto. Ow. <laughs> okay, so since Bunk doesn't have a shield but his belly, what happens when the light likes get him? Well, that's a gruesome scene. <laughs> Oh, come on. Okay, I can smell the staircase here. Be gone, filthy humans. <laughs> but yeah, I think the one thing I said about blocks earlier is that it seems like I need to push in a specific direction. Because I, I'm pretty sure that I pushed one block in one direction it didn't work, and then I changed direction and it did work. But that's the rule I know I'm gonna go by, that it's the middle one, it's the one most to the left. So if that one it doesn't work, then it's, yeah, it's clear. Man. Those, ad, those worm enemies from uh, Yabyov's Belly, I don't remember the name of them. But as a kid, Jabby Jabby's Belly and uh, Ocarina of Time, I despised that dungeon. Uh, I got lost easily and it was such an unpleasant place and and the enemies were really dangerous and nasty. And you know, that's that's I, I think one thing as a kid when I when I played games, I was afraid of progress or you know, because the more I progressed the harder the game was gonna be, and I was afraid of that. <laughs> oh, come on. Ah, you will not get my belly <laughs> or my precious boomerang. Oh. I, I I can see the same like childhood start of his legend, like in Ocarina of Time, you know, with Kokir Kokir Forest. But instead of the slingshot, it's the boomerang for for boom for Bunk. <laughs> I need more ladders. Oh my goodness, what are the odds of that? <laughs> Nice throw, Bunk. He's not such a scary cat any longer. Okay, it's just money. And I can't even grab him. Ah, okay, so you're, you're afraid that the rules of the moving blocks would change because it's uh, mirrored. Okay, yeah, yeah. I understand that. It doesn't seem like so. Okay, I can't dig in this dungeon any longer. Yes, moving out is the only. So I think I need a, I need a bow for this one. Can I clear this room before. Come on, Bunk. <laughs> oh, uh, dodging. Yeah, if I even try to go south there, I am dead. One last try. No. Oh. Okay. We need 
need to get back here at some point, huh? Boom. Let's get out of here. Oh, whoops, I forgot about this. Sorry, game volume is coming right back. So yeah, obviously, uh, I haven't made those songs exactly as if it was it was made at the same time. Uh, I'm using lots of uh, creative freedom, lots more shadows than, than the original Nintendo NES and Famicom system were cap capable of. So it, it's creative freedom with those songs. Uh, but I, I stick to as retro as possible with uh, very with uh, no reverbs. It's, it's just analog delays. But yeah, so like a deluxe NES edition of how Zelda music will, will be like, you know, kind of like Oc Ocarina of Time, but made in the 8-bit era, sort of. Uh, okay, we need to push more blocks. Good thing that Bunks knows this forest like his own back pocket. Fair bunk. No, he's not that kind of bunk. <laughs> he's more brain now, but he's still a bit of a nervous little Goraya who lacks self esteem. <laughs> it's like <laughs> just trying to find shiny stones and follow the legend of the boomerang. Uh, Wait, it's mirrored. Am I going the wrong way? I think I am. I very much am. Still don't think I have found a proper dungeon item. It's just the, you know, the boomerang dungeon item spots. I haven't found. Oh, I I can afford the ring soon. But I haven't found. The, I don't think I found any dungeon uh, and treasure room in any dungeon. That's the problem. Which means that I'm gonna get a lot of good stuff soon. Where's the forest fairy? Where's the forest fairy? Ah, there we go. Actually a good spot for a dungeon, I gotta be honest. Like, if I was a level designer and, and I was doing this, but you know, maybe like, imagine if Zelda 2 was still like a top world, top view, open world kind of game. But now the dungeons are more thematic. I will put one dungeon in a spot like this and call it the Forest Ruins or something. <laughs> do, do you have shiny stone? <laughs> oh. I tried to hype up that as much as possible, but it didn't work out. <laughs> I guess dungeon free here would be the forest ruins kind of dungeon because it was all green. 
I, I totally can get the blue ring. I still have it. It's, it's gonna be next dungeon. I'm gonna find the red ring. Or I could be so <laughs> unlucky that I actually did lock red ring to dungeon nine. I guess something in me tells me that I did not. And I will find the red ring there in in the next dungeon. Come on. Is it the last, last spot, right? No, it's not. Just one more. Yes, dungeon! <gasps> Level one! Yeah! And it's gonna be a Guma. No. Oh, here we go. Please. Okay, place your best, everyone. Raft. Leather. In this dungeon. Oh man, I like this by the way. Gray, gray uh, palette, and then green sludgy. You know what? This 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 looks like an 8-bit version of the uh, Hyrule Royal Tomb in the graveyard of uh, of Kakariko Village, right? All this place is missing is some nasty reed that's wandering around. I sadly don't have any spooky 8-bit uh, tomb kind of song. But I, I am going to grab that soon. Soon, TM. Oh, here we go. I finally finished sorting all my songs. Oh my! Um. Okay, it's it's not exploding. Yeah, I, I, I still kind of like, but my goodness. So the book only enhances <laughs> shiny stone. <laughs> Bunk. No, of course it's he. Wait, what, what? So if there's no stone in the middle, there is no, you're not able to push it, right? Uh, oh, you know, we're gonna wreck this one. <gasps> no bunk is feeling the power. Oh, here we go. Oh, taste this. <laughs> okay, this was a big leap. Oh, all the way. <laughs> it's amazing that we found the, the uh, white sword in the in dungeon. Uh, was it four? So up until that, we, we really kind of follow the vanilla progression. But now we've made a big leap. We have the <laughs> magic wand. <laughs> now, Bunk can be a wizard. You're a wizard, Bunk. <laughs> oh my goodness, can I even. No, not even the wand. <laughs> not even the wand. Wait, maybe the boomerang. The answer to every threat. No, flee, Bunk. Okay, that's a bummer. I need a flute. Okay. Chat, I need you here. Left or right? I mean, we have enough keys, but let's not waste them. Left or right? Which one will... Should give me the treasures. <laughs> oh! That was my D-pad. <laughs> I barely touched that door. Did you see that? That was the quickest door opening. Like, Bunk just ran past, like, threw the key into the keyhole. <laughs> and it was the wrong... Uh, oh, wait, did I... No, I was like... Did I went through his armor? I didn't. Okay, we got a map. What is this? It's a spirit of some sorts. For some reason. Like a spirit that is bound to a little bottle or something. To be honest, my the first thing that popped into my mind was a insect of some sort. 
if I'm gonna be completely honest. Like, I won't leg the insect. <laughs> There's no good... I don't know. One-legged insect dungeon doesn't really <laughs> roll off your tongue. Yeah, it's, it, it, it's interesting to see uh, what everyone's seeing. There we go. Okay. This is the most obvious wall bump spot I've ever seen. Yes. So yeah, this is the creepy tomb uh, dungeon. Oh, there's a treasure room ahead. I think. Oh. Get away from him. <laughs> Another key. Another shiny thing to collect for Bunk. Oh, it's the flute. It's the flute. It's actually pretty nice. Now Book can play music by the campfire. <laughs> it's like he's finding all these legendary items and he's he's just using them for fun or something. <laughs> and it is isn't that much legendary. A candle isn't legendary. Uh I yeah yeah yeah. Dudongo dwells in the dead woods. Yeah, 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 okay. That's the... Uh, so the dongle in that one... That's dungeon 4, right? Now wait. South Eastern Brown, that's dungeon 2. Now why couldn't we... Was that... Uh, I think that was a raft one, right? I see a face with open mouth and a big nose. 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 Nows. How I forgot how to pronounce that word. My my news. No no. What? <laughs> the black part of the right is hair. Ah. That's very right. Yeah. You know, when you when you put it like this, do you see what? Do you know what I see now? I see a. Some sort of uh, serpent with wings facing to the right. That was a nice ob observation. I kept thinking that it was facing to the left, but if you think as it as facing to the right, it's easier. Oh, I mean, we don't have to waste bombs, probably. <laughs> Keep it secret. The scary thing is that secret walls or rooms is still a thing. Ah. Please don't drop anything important. Please don't drop anything important. Wait, I've been here before. Uh, that key is a waste. That's not wasted. This could be... Well, I mean, now we have both friendly... Uh, whatever these are called. No, again. Sorry, I, I, need, I need to... What, what are the name of those? P-Hat. Yeah, it is P-Hat. So we have both friendly P-Hats and then hostile P-Hats on the surface. And they, they are they, they are talking, so... <laughs> they are sentient, so... Quick, we need, uh, we need some lore for the, for the peacocks. For the P-Hats! Oh, did you see the double one?
I almost opened the left door. And that would have been a big waste. All right, I guess we we vacuum clean because dungeon one doesn't have, doesn't have two items, right? It just got the boomerang. Oh wait, doesn't dungeon one have boomerang and bow? Aha, uh -huh, there was more to this room than I first thought. <laughs> Poink! Force is locked. Right? Or I think... Oh my goodness, no. I think it's absolutely useless. That, because that's, that's... Yeah, yeah, it's... They are not, they're not gonna drop anything. They are not gonna drop anything. Right? Oh, I'm so glad that... That one of the uh, blue uh, dark nut uh, rooms is completely optional. All right, that's the uh... yeah, that's the whole dungeon. Oh, yeah, because that's the entrance. That's right. So just one item. All right. You cross that one off, and we have one more power bracelet spot. Uh, it's uh... oh yeah. Right. <laughs> the one thing that bunks is after in his word. He forgot his shiny stone. Shiny stone. Oh. I I really forgot about him. <laughs> yes. That's actually perfect. I needed the teleport. Oh no, I thought it was going to teleport. Oh, yeah, okay. We are slowly, yeah, we are slowly getting finished with this. The world is fully explored. We are going to get all the dungeons. Easy peasy. Now his bunk needs to find his way home. Alright, tree, have a good one with the dinner. Smartly maltine, as you would say in Sweden. Uh. It's the equivalent of bon appetit in French. I have so much money that I need to waste on something. Here's my home! Yes! Totally worth it. Oh my goodness. Bunk. Bunk. What had it done to your outfit? <laughs> Alright, now we're gonna steamroll this. Cue the Eye of the Tiger montage. <laughs> oh. I, oh. And the first thing Bunk does is walk into his own weapon. 
<laughs> it's like, he thinks he's really like, I can take on anything, and then he still makes the same mistakes as he did in the beginning of his adventure. Oh, I'm getting all the bombs now. <laughs> Book is having too much fun with his weapon, he's got, he's got destroyed the whole world. <laughs> like, <laughs> fires everywhere. Uh, we are going for the last moving rock. Oh yeah, I forgot we did a teleportation system. Okay. So let's see if my prediction is going to become reality. The very next dungeon, I am going to find the red ring. Oh, it would be so, so typical, my luck. Uh, wrong. See, the P, the P hat people. <laughs> the P hat people. <laughs> Now we, need, now we need a theme song for the pea hat people. The pea hat people. <laughs> you know, everyone loves the the Goron theme from Ocarina of Time, but the uh, the song for Crescent Island for Oracle of Ages for the uh, Tukua people is that what they named the lizard people? That song is very much you know in in in. Uh, in ship two format, that song is very much tribal, but even more catchy than the Gorm ones, I'd say, almost. I mean, they're pro equally as catchy, but man, that song is really good. It, it, it was either Tukua or Tur Turkua, people. Uh, let's see here, this moving... No, 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 no. Wait a second. I mean, yes, 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 yes it should be here. It should be somewhere from when you enter at the gray yards, right? Oh, look at this. You know what? I I need to I need to debunk this. I, I need to stop being uncertain like like Bunk about things. I need to be dead sure there is no bomb spot here. I'm pretty sure there isn't. Nope, oh, okay, nice. We can forever scratch that uncert uh, that <laughs> uncert uncertain I can't pronounce the word. I really need to practice my English. <laughs> oh my goodness. But I no longer have to, like, I have a second thought about the place. And now I know for dead sure that arrow spot is void. There's no way we're gonna find a bomb spot. in here now again. Ah. Dead end. Why? Oh, there it is. I'm just joking. Uh, to celebrate this last piece of progress, we're gonna 
finish you off. <laughs> See, because I remember it was on the left side, but at least for this one, mirror seems to apply. Oh um, my, okay. I guess we got medicine now. That was a very weird boomerang throw. Yes, thank you. Oof, my other stream almost died there. <laughs> that was close. Hello. I it, it I'm 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 seriously thinking that I forgot about there is one bomb spot left. Oh was this now again? Ow. Oh yeah, it was a scam. It was a scam. No, wait, wait, no, wait. that was not a scam. What is your wisdom, oh great pea head? Drink more oval time. <laughs> What's that? Uh, look at the prices! Oh, way more expensive. <laughs> what on earth is oval time? I have no clue what it is. <laughs> oval time. It sounds disgusting. Maybe it isn't. Okay, that was all the power bracelet spots. So now what? Obviously we need to check every single dungeon and the fight to defeat, defeat Hydras. I swear, Sofden got a big raft up, it, up their bum. <laughs> Bunk, you're supposed to be the boomerang here. <laughs> I can guess. No dungeon in either of these holes. A scene on TV. We're gonna need the arrows though. Maybe? Wait. I think. I think we don't. If we find the silver arrows first. Okay, this seems very bomb holy. Okay, I seriously have no clue what <laughs> what this one was supposed to say in the original game. I I don't remember. I don't remember. <laughs> I'm gonna play a two for you, old man. Or old Ukturuk. No? The same melody used for the teleportation in Super Mario 3, by the way. Da -da -da. And also is the melody for the uh, title theme of Ocarina of Time. Like, how how could it be not? Oh, how can that not be a bomb spot? Oh my God! It's, it's here! It's of course it's here! And I wasted bombs. I know I have checked this before. Uh. Oh my goodness! How did I not check that spot earlier? 200 rupees, really? Just for a bank? <gasps> hey, that's not 200. <laughs> I think there is supposed to be bombs, but above the stairs? Above the stairs? 
Or here, but I... Did I place a bomb here right now? Maybe if I punch this long enough... <laughs> Wait, so you're telling me there's a bomb spot here? I'm pretty sure I checked this one before I went down here. You guys remember, it's mirrored, so... <gasps> nope! The chat has failed me once again. <laughs> I, I'm, here is a bomb spot, I am suspecting so hard. Okay. Maybe here? Oh no, here! Oh my goodness, that's the bomb spot. I'm so sure of it. Now give me the bombs. No, I got hit! Oh, I got hit. I mean, I, 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 could, I could teleport and just buy bombs. Or... Why buy? We can get them for free! Ah, there we go! <laughs> like, we use outfit bunk looks like a thief or some, some sort. I, I think it's, like it's better if Bunks is, uh, he just wants to be here, so he tries to dress up like a hero. <laughs> I think that's, that's even better. So I think we have to go to the left, right? Ah, okay, okay, so it was the second quest, okay. But here, 100% sure. Yes! <laughs> No. <laughs> oh, ten. I guess I could buy the meat. Uh, okay. Oh my god. So I need to revisit a lot of dungeons. The worst part is, what if I had to dip into Dungeon 9? But if, no, I think I need Silver Arrows first for it. You know what? I think we can take on a Hydra. We're gonna go for the, to Dungeon 4 again. Thankfully, it's one of the few dungeons that I've actually noted on that piece of paper. Uh, I'm just gonna... Oh, it's a dungeon! <laughs> okay, I absolutely need to write this one down, in case we're not gonna finish this one now. So, dungeon 8... Uh, I'm gonna say near again, right? All right, time to vacuum clean this dungeon. I never went up, did I? Excuse me. Go 
good thing we have a key. Hello, yes! Bunker's new clothes, we have the magic wand. W wand! What's happening? My, my brain is melting or something. <laughs> and uh, we have, yes, we have bought the blue ring. And we have yet to find the red ring, so that saves us a pretty good one. Uh, this is the this is the uh, bomb wall dungeon. So I'm gonna no. There we go. <laughs> Bunk is getting close on collecting all the magic shiny stones. Oh. <gasps> oh my. Mm. No more key problems. <laughs> Now Boon can find all the shiny treasures. It's like a mix of he has a he's following a a quest. He's yet to find his precious magic boomerang. Another shiny stone. Where's the magic boomerang? The one that he was destined to find. He haven't found it yet. Huh? I do like the detail in Oracle of Age and Season that if you burn the uh, Gibdo, they become skeletons. Or Stalophus. I smell bomb. Nope. That was a very. <laughs> It's gonna be scary. <laughs> Absolutely. Uh, and if you're gonna think like in Zelda, I, I love that they. Uh, they, they take this unique dungeon item and give you new ways of to interact with enemies. Like in Twilight Princess, they are these armored foes that is really difficult to handle because they have full plate armor to the front. You need to try to run around them and hit them in the back. But you get to, you, then you get the grapple hook in the dungeon and now you can just remove that plate armor and easily defeat them. Yeah, I like that. Oh, what on earth is this? I know exactly what everyone's thinking right now, but let, let's try to be way more creative than this. Because that's, that is absolutely, that is a handgun. <laughs> if I ever seen one. Although the trigger is to the right, to the wrong direction. So what could it be instead? Maybe it's a shrimp. It's a shrimp. Oh, why, why do I even hesitate? I have the... I have infinite keys. There we go. Uh, I need to quickly use at least one. Before that one disappears. No, no! Oh, nice. This is Bunk's new toy. <laughs> <laughs> Semi-pendium 
plenty fun with it. <laughs> okay. No, I really thought that this was gonna be a push room. You know, let, let, let's fight it. The as as the legendary bunk. We don't need no magic wand when we have a boomerang, and a sword. Because I know that the uh, the seller community that the boomerang is useless in this game, but I I like it. Okay. You again see a face. Yeah, that's the thing with the Rorschach test. We all see different things, and it's, it can be interesting as to why we all. No! You leave Bunk's belly alone. <laughs> like, I, I've been the unluckiest when it comes to finding secrets. Huh? Except for these. <laughs> Oh, here we go. As I was saying. Okay, the voice is gonna be way fast like this. Oh no, stop, because it's gonna cause so much lag. I know that this this fiend is smiling, but it also got four eyes, and when you destroy it, it 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 just becomes many many bats or keys, keys. Oh no! So I think you know in a more. I, I want to say that Ocarina of Time is more mature. Uh, because there's no way. Here's the thing. I know that a lot of people say that. Oh yeah, of time. It was supposed to be more distant like. Just like the other Zelda's. Just look at the artwork. There is no way that you make a read dead like that. And you have the vision of a cartoony, colorful, jolly Disney kind of game. There's no way you're gonna you're gonna design a dead hand <laughs> uh, while having that as a goal. Uh, so I really don't think that's the case the people's theory with uh, with that okay it wasn't supposed to be as dark as it was I, I'm pretty sure it's I mean when I say dark I think people when, when, when they when they say that oh yeah dark so it's supposed to be you know gory and uh, you know stuff like that like and th that's not the point like dark can be it doesn't have to be sinister. I didn't get anything from this room. Or it doesn't have to be morbid or yeah, gory. Uh, I I think that Orchid Time really managed to uh, have a I don't know. It's just a realistic and mature take on adventure where yeah, you will absolutely find really scary places sometimes. Is, is Are we gonna bet that this is a very secret room? Nope. And so... Yeah, I, I used... So, where I was going with that, I was wondering how that enemy would look like if it was made in Ocarina of Time, for example, or... As I was trying to say, a, a more mature Zelda. And... Uh, or a more darker Zelda. Which, which one? Uh, for example, Orc of Agents and Seasons. I do love them, but when you look at some enemies, you realize that yeah, this this was kind of like a it's uh, <laughs> very 
goofy enemy design. You have a you have a mole with sunglasses. You know, Im imagine if you're walking in the bottom of the well in Ocarina of Time and you find a mole wearing sunglasses. Instant immersion break. <laughs> <laughs> and I don't know when it comes to the silly things in Ocarina of Time because you know and I think that's a you know a great adventure has everything it's comedy sorrow action darkness you know love adventure got it all a, a true adventure and even though there's there's silly things in and the silly things in Ocarina of Time I think they're more Realistic, which is a weird thing to say in a video game where if you cut a bush, there's a heart. A heart pops out of it. <laughs> but yeah, so I, I really don't know. You know, like the Moving King. Now, it's a silly thing, but it's also totally a thing that could happen in such a world. Uh, you know, like a world still has rules, even though it's not realistic. According to our world, it might be realistic to their world. You know, a, a big fish king that's, that is taking 50 minutes to move his ass. <laughs> you know, it's, 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 it, it could happen. It's, 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 a, it's a character trait. But a mole wearing sunglasses? That is more like a... That's more like a... Reference to our world. Like, haha, see? Mole wearing sunglasses? Is that fun? Like a dog wearing sunglasses. Uh, okay, we need to defeat this. You are not allowed to use the boomerang. <laughs> oh, there's lots of low potential behind this. But yeah, that that's where I was trying to get. I, I'm really wondering how those blue bat things will will look like if it were made in like an Ocarina of Time. Like uh, I'd, I'd keep the smile, but that smile would, would be really, really creeping. I just want to see. Would it be funny if? It's, it's impossible, but it would be funny if they dropped the ladder if I destroyed the last one here. Be gone with you. <laughs> you can't hit me. <laughs> nothing. Absolutely nothing. Okay, I'm gonna use the teleportation, which was up left. Oh, this is a dungeon that can easily get lost in. Like those enemies. See, they're smiling. Or is it? Is it the shin? I I think I always seen that as them smiling. Yeah, it's probably them smiling. But they also have four eyes, now, so it could be. Yeah, like the uncanny weird feeling. I mean, it can be a smiling feet, but it can be like a. The skin is cracked and dirty and full of blisters. You can absolutely make that creepy. Oh, here we go. <laughs> I'm drowning fairies. So next item I'm gonna buy probably gonna be a shield. I'm wondering if the magic wand is making is doing more damage than the white sword. Oh my goodness, look at it, give those Burn them! <laughs> For example, a, a, a good piece of, you know, when you think about dark, Majora's Mask, the whole theme is dark. But it's also not really showing 
no, it's, there's, there's no there's no pointless violence or anything like that. It's 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 just really it's kind of real. It's you know showing true human emotions during during dire situations like despair and stuff like that and sadness and sorrow. And that game is so unique. I I really. It was a, such a shame that they changed it so much in the remaster. And I think I think the, I think the main reason was that oh yeah, there were so many people that didn't finish it. But what about the thousands of people who did finish it? And when I say you know, uh, like yo, so a few thousand compared to a few millions who didn't finish it. Well, we don't know the statistics, absolutely, but... And I do know a lot of people who didn't finish it. And who didn't like it. Didn't like the say system. And... I, you know, I guess so. Uh, compared to Ocarina of Time, where you can save anywhere. And if you if you save with Ross you have to do lots of stuff all over again. Bye. Ah. Oh. Wait, wait, I can probably try to bomb... Oh! Explosions! Oh! 12 bombs. This is nice. This was totally worth it. Oh! Yoink! <laughs> bunk! That is, that is typical bunk. Okay, are you gonna drop something? Or are you still here to ruin my day? Uh -huh. You're just here to ruin my day. Can I? I really don't remember how many hearts I need. F I need for magical sword. Alone. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Up it is. Oh, is that? Oh my! Oh wow! Do they even have? Yeah, do they have this kind of room in original? In the original version? Because this is actually the thing in Ocarina of Time. This we are. You get locked in with a few monsters. Is this... I'm pretty sure it's a thing in the real game. Or maybe the... Ah. I like this. I, I say... The, oh my goodness. I say this is one of the core... Zelda things. Uh, like a typical dungeon... Uh, design. Like get locked in with a few enemies. Defeat them and then move on. Or, you know, get rewarded with something and then the door unlocks behind you again. Somewhere there's gonna be a secret. I really don't know if... If uh, Dungeon 8 has secret rooms, though. I think we should just... Just use the staircase again. Really need to do this. <laughs> Leave me alone. <sighs> Very for being a random dungeon. I, I, I actually don't know if the. I think the shapes are random. But that's a very fitting spot for a for the 
for the last item. If the entrance would have been a different spot, because the entrance is right next to it, I guess. Oh, this is one big dungeon. I'm afraid that I need to defeat that Guma. We need, we need a bow. Oh, we really need a bow. At this point, have I found all the dungeons? I don't think I found dungeon five. I was kind of gonna play some best that we could fight in one of the raft spots. No, the money. So I guess left and try to bomb south. Okay. Easy peasy. Because Dungeon 8, I know, is supposed to have two items. If it's still a thing, maybe it's switched up. Because I think Dungeon 1 was supposed to have two items as well. And I found just one there. Oh, 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 oh. Dungeon 8, are you absolutely... <laughs> no, no bunk can reach those apples <laughs> up, up and high in the tall trees. <laughs> oh. But I really don't need this any longer. But we're gonna do it just for old grudge's sake. How dare you? I don't think I don't even think bomb works in this one. Nope. How about fire against fire? Nope. Oh, I almost beat this one with with just a wooden sword. Can't even imagine that. Uh, I, I'm actually, I need to get the word now. I was kind of relaxed because I thought, yeah, blue ring. Oh, bombs. Well, that was revenge for the nose dip. <laughs> oh, no, that was a very scary room. Uh, okay, yeah, so, right, right, right. Uh, three. I think having no idea what was can be destroyed is one of the biggest flaws of the first game. It's a good thing a link to the past introduced the feature to eat your sword against walls and find secrets with an audio cue. Was that a link to the past feature? Oh yeah. yeah. But also, was it every wall having a visible crack in it to make it really easy? To because I think that's that's one thing that makes it, yeah, you know, for, absolutely for some walls. And it's a nice introduction to to really tell the player that, yes, there will be secrets in walls. Here are, here are those that have a crack that is, you know, obviously being a secret or, you know, we can use the bomb on it. Uh, and then, uh, I think that's a great solution. Was it really a thing? Wasn't, wasn't every wall in Link to the Past cracked as well? But that, that is a good touch that you can use the sword to poke the wall and you will hear a different kind of clang. But, uh, you know, to, to really keep secrets being 
secrets and I will absolutely add walls that had no visible Oh nice. We even need it in this dungeon. Uh walls that have no visible uh hints that they are secret. Other than maybe like a uh weird position. Okay. But yeah, you're right. Oh, oh my! <laughs> Every single Hydra and Bunkus. <laughs> right up to the ass of the Hydra. <laughs> I can't believe it. <laughs> it's a random ice. It happened every single time I found one. <laughs> oh, and this one might actually destroy us. Yeah, because there's another. I'm just gonna go for it. Go, bunk. <sighs> we, we are truly bunk, bunk, bunk the brown nose. <laughs> <laughs> For all the wrong reasons. <laughs> oh, at this point, is is unavoidable. Fair enough, it's gonna rise from this. Oh no! And this is also a very big. No, 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 no. <laughs> Unless I ace it like that. <laughs> Also very, I think, well, like poor, poor Bunk trying to explore a dungeon and accidentally just... <laughs> it's so dark in a... <laughs> he said, Aquamentus awaits by the Lost Hills. And now what on earth is the Lost Hills? Aquamentus? Who's Aquamentus? <laughs> Alright, but uh, I guess we're done with this place. We found the red key and we found the ladder, so there's no more items in here. Unless it's so randomized that there can be more than two items in the dungeon. There we go. Yeah, yeah. So this turn is now fully explored. I think. I hope. And the reward? <laughs> Shine stone. I don't think that's a bunk noise. <laughs> He's very happy. Oops. Ah, bunk is powerful. All right. I think I'm actually gonna take a break now. It's uh, wow. Well, yeah, it's ring holding Sunday special. Ah, uh, but yeah. You know, obviously, games have gone up, have come a far away, but there's something uh, from this, absolutely. But you know, there, there's a charm to it, and that's nostalgia, absolutely. But it, there's something also about the simplicity. It's just so simple. There's no, this little dialogue. It's just, I don't know. I, I, I like it, and also, you know, the most open Legend of Zelda there is. Each each uh, release you know, being more and more holding you by the hand and not telling you what to do. Oh, sorry, obvious opposite, telling you what to do, when to do it, and here's just 
completely open. Completely, you can go anywhere. But now we need to save, and that is a very horrible thing because <laughs> the only way to save is to. <laughs> Poor Punk, no? Yeah, now we, now we can go to dungeon 2, because we got ladder block there. Yeah, yeah, we... We're going places, no? And the breath of the wild. Yeah, yeah, you're absolutely right. But, again, and this is me, I... I, <laughs> I absolutely, I'm, I am a Zelda fan, I love Zelda. But I, I wish that Breath of the Wild could have kept the things that, that make Zelda Zelda. And for me, the, the one major thing is thematic dungeons. That That's the one thing I miss. Like, thematic puzzle-like dungeons. Because all the the four wandering beast temples, they you know, kind of look like the same and wasn't really that complex either. But it's still a great game. Absolutely. But it's just... Ah. And the thing is, for example, Skyward Sword, I, I would probably love that game if it wasn't for Fi. Fi is the worst kind of companion. Where Midna is the best one, and I'd say Navi, actually, is the second one. Because of her role. I, that ending, Ocarina of Time, which applies to basis, <laughs> it's really good. And, you know, I hope... Because Navi, even though nagging a little bit here and there, still optional. Fi is not optional. <laughs> At all. Uh, that and the fact that Skyward Sword just holds you by the hand so much. and It's not. It, it's immersion breaking when the game tells you what to do. And it doesn't feel like a. It, there's no ancient text, you know, that you have to decipher. And oh, okay, wait. So, this this ancient people wrote this on tablet. And oh, I, if if I, oh, I they, so I probably should go here. You know, you, it's like a puzzle on its own. But no, in Skyrim Sword, it's it's it's, it's just the developers like writing a text like here you do this to solve that. It's just it's just, it's just bad. Uh, or should I say for shield? Eh. Save shield. But other than that, you know, the, the, the dungeon design of uh, Sky Resort is, is amazing. So I actually need to play the game. Hoping for a fan patch that, that kind of patch these things out. Removing five completely from the game. <laughs> <laughs> And Skyward Sword, you know, and they, they, there's less music in Skyward Sword, even though there's a few places that I... I don't remember the place of it, but there's a few, there's like a village theme that I really love from Skyward Sword. And yeah, you know, with a big-ass open-world game like that, you can't have a heroic tune all the time, but at least... I don't, I don't know, I, it's, it's less thematic than the other Zelda games, that's, that's my only gripe with it. And yes, characters that helps with position always be optional, absolutely. And and you know that's 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 just developers not having faith in the players. Like, oh, what if they don't figure this out? You know, what if they get bored? Oh, they're gonna think this is a bad game. Oh, I need to help them. Like, have have faith, have have trust in your game design, and you you won't need that. Like, if you if you just design the game really well. Then you won't need to give players that extra hand. I'm gonna. Step over the water to reach the heart container. Oh my goodness, yes. I know. <laughs> but if we can go for it, uh, I'm gonna go for that before I quit. Uh, did I did I put a note down on yeah northwest yeah I know I know where the message was 
good. So yeah, so in Ocarina of Time, when it comes to the helper, yes, Navi should not nag as much as she does in the game. I I do, but but you have to also. They they decide the game for a 3D world game for the very first time, and players not being used to that at all. You know, it's the, for 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 a majority of players, it's the very first time they even, you know, you know, that it was mind blowing for. I remember my big brother, uh, we we got a ride, our parents drove through the nearest shop and we, we bought a of time. We were stoked and my goodness, it was mind blowing. It was absolutely mind blowing. You know, the very first time you actually got a such a heavy story game. Uh, at least for us and for a lot of people. Got Super Mario, you know, so it's it's a it's a, no, it's a simple story and it's designed like that. And there's probably there's probably eight bit games that try to be lore heavy, like um, Ninja Gaiden, I guess. I think try to do it with the uh, cutscenes and such. But oof, Ocarina of Time is just mind blown. So yeah, you have, you have to you have to remember that the design for a whole generation of a gamer that's so new to that to that. To such a game, so yeah, they they probably felt that they needed to mention the players a few times. That yeah, you 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 here is Navi. Listen to her, and she will help you out. And uh, there's a friendly reminder here and there. Yeah, you know. I think it it shows much. They they still trust it because you know they could have absolutely. Back then, you know, shut down every advice done throughout the games, and they still choose not to do it. They still choose it to be optional. I think they also show that they they really respect the players to figure things out with little with uh, little help. Uh, was it here? No, no, no. I'm stupid. It's 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 way up to north. More like here. Not here. It's up here. Now the question is, is it enough? No, <laughs> no, it's never enough. <laughs> it's never enough. No? Here's the thing, do you, do you know why I hesitate to save the game? Because Bunk needs to die in order for me to save. And I need to do it on purpose. That is horrible. <laughs> I don't want to do it. I think I think here is a bomb spot in, in, in the second quest, right? It was in second quest, right? Yeah, it must be. It must be second quest. Ah, nice shortcut. Oh yeah, we have the flute as well, so we can go for the lake. I just, I just want to find the desert. What's down here? Uh, three. I guess five was made because if we had a big ca casual audience that might not be used to games like that. But she should really not be forced to never play it. Yeah. It should, it should be the option in the menu. But at the same time, you know, if, if you have a casual audience, then they might not, not even think about looking for the option. Uh, you know, may maybe forced hint should be on by default and... But that, that also that also kind of you know <laughs> to to make uh, the uh, fan base and experienced players like oh yeah if you want the 
the true game experience. You need to go to the options and change things. It, it just, I don't know. True game design wise, that I think, yeah. That's, that would be the solution, but. Uh, if he, no, it, it do feel like because of that, yeah, we, we, we have designed this with casual gamers in mind first, that, and you guys who have kept buying your games for. I don't remember. Oh, yeah, it teleports me through dungeons. Ooh. Ah. That's right. I forgot about that. But this is that's just a pet peeve. Obviously, that would be the best choice to have a on or off for that in options. So I'm guessing in its its second quest where you where you had to use the flute and a doorway appears. It yeah, that must be a thing. Okay. So before I go, I'm just gonna find the lake. Is it to the west? No, it's to the to the east. It's the one thing I dislike in games that the very first thing you go for in the menu, you know, before, you, maybe sometimes before you even get to the menu when you start the game, is to see like, a, oh yeah, here you can go here if you want to, if you want to visit the shop, or you know, it's, here's a link to the site. That should be optional. It should not be the first thing you see when you start the game, because <laughs> that's, that's essentially the developers tell you, oh, you started this, you start this game. Maybe you want to. Not play the game and check these things first. That should not be the first thing you see in a game. Uh, it should be on a second menu or something. When you start a game, it should be a menu for options and play, campaign, multiplayer, stuff like that. Not for the optional stuff. The optional, but uh, and the only reason why they put it like that is, you know, the big company was money, and they, they, they don't trust people. They don't trust that people will. Oh yeah, I, I'm gonna have a look at the shop later on. But no, 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 no. Look at this now. No, 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 no. And it's so annoying, and I hate it. So, one of one of uh, one example of that is I I play the Total War Warhammer series one and two. I bought the third one. I returned it. It was not finished, and frankly, I think it's worse than the second one. The only thing that that really makes it uh, 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 that makes it uh, something I want is that it, it allows more than two players to play cooperative campaign. Up to eight players, that is amazing. I know I want that. Uh, but anyway, so yeah, so in the in the second game, you start the game and the only menu you see is. Well, there is a tiny button for DLC, at the, but it's at the very bottom. You have play and the campaign and, you know, all, everything on the very first page to start playing. The third game has an entire first page of, yeah, which is our site here and, oh, here's the store before you even get to the campaign menu. Although maybe they changed that, I hope so, but, I don't know, it just, it was more, uh, Guiding you to shop and all other crap like that, and it's just it's ex oh my goodness no not the how do we go it's exhausting I think it's just exhausting. I, I was playing Bethesda's new uh, latest it's pretty old now I guess but latest uh, Quake. And at the end of the round, there is a forced loot box drop, and you need to watch the animation as they ooh, open it with flashy effects and stuff like that. And you're forced to see that every single time you finish a round, and that is absolutely shit. <laughs> it's, it's just it's just a time waste because I don't care about it. I'm, I'm never gonna buy a loot box, so it's just forcing you to see that 
so that you know, so they have a bigger chance of making people addicted to buy new boxes. And it's such a nasty move. And so Bethesda is a shit company because it's not the same guys that made the legendary Elder Scrolls and Fallout One and Two games. It's not the same company. Trust me. There's there's both everything. Okay, there's a lake. <laughs> so, uh, I'm a gamer that's not buying that many games nowadays. <laughs> and it's a dungeon. Of course it's a dungeon. It's a level 7. Oh man, I really would want... Wait, or can you save without... No, that's impossible, right? I think I need to die in order to save. Yeah. I tried to play Select the Sword at the same time because that's how you get to save menu in Orc of Seeds and the Ages, but no. I need to perish in order to save. So everyone close your eyes now. Oh. Oh, here we go. Oh, yeah, you can you can wreck me. Oh, no, Bunk. Don't do this. There we go. Nice. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh. <laughs> no, fuck. <laughs> that is so. You know, it, 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 I think it's a shame that so many players they will look. Like, Why do you care? It's just a, it's just a game. Just, just, just go and kill yourself. So you can say, "Come on," and you know, I, I get immersive. I like to, you know, it's just a game, but it, it's a story written by other humans, and and also you can apply your own emotions and experience. In the characters in the game, in the one of your player. That's what I love about horror games, where the character doesn't talk except for in the, in the cutscenes. That's why I love like Silent Hill Two, for example, because James doesn't say anything, barely anything during the actual gameplay, only in the cutscenes. Uh, so that makes it so that when something horrifying happens it's your experience it's it's because it's easier to really you know you are james it's very easy to get into the character if the character because when you have a horror game where the character is is doing directions for you then you're not given the chance to react on the thing in the game it's not going to be as scary at least that's my just humble opinion <laughs> but I, I think it's real annoying when the when the game's when the game character goes, oh no, that's so scary. Because sometimes it might have been like, nah, you might not think it's scary. You know, it's like uh, that jump scare wasn't scary. You know, for some people, for example, <laughs> uh, a nice example, uh, the, the movie The Grudge. Uh, I watched it with my family. Uh, this is the movie that, that messed me up. I, 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 I think I was slightly traumatized, <laughs> to be honest. I could. I didn't sleep a second after I saw the grudge. As soon as I closed my eyes, I just saw her face. I was sweating. I, I was. I was. Uh, I'm seriously. I. I. I had to throw my bed clothes into the wash machine next day. It, it was insane. It, it horrified me that movie. I, I really got into it. <laughs> and uh, uh, yeah, I hated that sound she made. Uh, no, I. I didn't. I didn't even feel safe in my bed because I was I was afraid of the dark when I was a kid. Uh, at least when I was alone. I think it's I think, I think it's more being alone that that's that's uh, my big uh, fear in life. Uh, and uh, and yeah, so and that movie ruined like the bed was not safe any longer. So I had missed my missed my big time. Anyway. Uh, my fa the rest of my family almost fell asleep during the movie. They thought it was the worst movie ever. The only time they got scared was when the cat jumped out of the closet. 
It's just a cheap jump scare, but they they got scared by it. They didn't think that the ghost was scary. And that's because uh, everyone has their own different kind of you know beliefs and experiences in their mind. Like uh, th that's not a ghost. That's just a person in makeup. You know. They they just couldn't get into it. Then. And you know that's because everyone's different. So fear is different for everyone. Or what's scary and stuff like that. So. Uh, that that's I really don't think that I think that I think that when you make a horror uh, mo a game, you should not let. Because if 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 a sheep jump scare shows up, that that doesn't scare you, but the character freaks out, that's just gonna annoy you. <laughs> so uh, yeah, I I really I really like it when uh, the uh, character you're playing is silent, and so it's easy to climb into that role, so to say. Because I, I think I think that's, that's the one main reason we play games nowadays. In the past, in the in the beginning, you know, when it was all about scores and squares, it was just about the score and the competition. But as games got more involved with with story stuff like that, and uh, you know, it led to Zelda. It's the the games gives the the uh, potential to experience something we would never do in real life, such as being a hero. Like Link in the Legend of Zelda, that is uh, something you would never experience in real life. That's why I play games at least. <laughs> oh my goodness! All right, thank you so much for this five and a half hour long stream. Uh, I think we can take away almost an hour because I was making dinner. <laughs> I missed it. All right, but it's been fun, and I'm gonna continue this. Uh, maybe not next stream. I want to. I don't want to grind something. Uh, you know, every single day, or you know, I need to. I need to finish this quickly. I can take a break. At the, at the same time, I can't take a too long break, right? Because I start forget. Like, where, where was I? <laughs> oh yeah. Are those on the same screen? Bunk's siblings, Bank and Bonk. <laughs> <laughs> Bunk, Bank and Bonk. We we need to implement this in a fan made Zelda game. Bunk, bank, and bonk. The boomerang throwing gang. That is not evil or sinister one. That is mischievous. That is not evil. Because Bunk is not evil. He's just an innocent little uh, Goraya. Alright. Nice. Uh, thank you all so much for being here. Tree, Cat Minion, Chimney, Final Fantasy. <laughs> oh no, I did. I did not uh, fall asleep in the shower. Phone, <laughs> uh, phone bonus knowledge. Uh, I watch them uh, once upon a time. Once upon a time, I watched the movie with Pierce Brosnan where a volcano erupts. Right, uh, I forgot the name of the movie. I remember it's a pretty good movie, so watch it, but it also kind of is very real, you know, with the poor victims, <laughs> so be beware, I guess, but, uh, but yeah, so after that movie, I had this weird fear, you know, I, I, I couldn't have been that old when I watched it, because I was I was worried that if I was taking while taking a shower, I was afraid that lava was gonna get out of the nozzle <laughs> instead of hot water. <laughs> or something like that. I as far as I remember remember it. <laughs> oh my goodness. Fear can be so illogical sometimes. <laughs> Because I, I I probably knew it was impossible, but I, I'm still afraid of it. <laughs> oh. And uh, to be to be uh, our our shower back then was in a creepy cellar, so I it it really didn't help with my traumatized with my you know I've always been afraid of things, so uh, and no. Oh my goodness. Alright, I'm going to take a break. 
and uh, yeah thank you so much and uh, as always follow your heart uh, have a good one have a good weekend and see you next week oh it's Sunday by the way here it is whoops <laughs> alright take care bye 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 bye